Folks, told you to stop doubting me. Here we are, Bay Pines. We're going to get some resonations today. Is, folks, go to the website. The evidence is there. We got the FOIA request for this lady, Justina Wells, rated me a 0.0. .0. Ma'am, you can't hide from reality, in fact. You got to go, ma'am. You, you're, you're doing things that are illegal. We're going to demand you go to jail, ma'am. We're going to demand Congress looks into this nightmare. Sergeant Grizzlegritz had done that. Look, y'all, y'all... Y'all suspended my old supervisor for two days for vaping. But y'all get away with illegally firing people. It's it's outrageous, folks. We gotta we gotta demand more out of our our public officials. This is despicable. Folks, I'm not making this stuff up. Just go to the website. Everything's there. <sighs> folks, we're gonna be a little more calm today. The voice is about to give out. We gotta let these demons know. Let these demons know right here, buddy, right here. That's right, that's right, these people know. We gotta go. Right here, buddy. They're harming, they're harming veterans, brother. That's right, friend, that's right. Right, that's right, buddy. They gotta go. They gotta go. They gotta go. They gotta go. It's perverted. Look at these perverted jeeps. Look at these people. All these people in these jeeps. There's something up with the jeeps. God's telling me something's wrong with these jeeps. They got a little club. I think that might have been the white jeep that was out in front of my house. Friends, they, they got people coming to our house. People, I got cameras all over the base, the fire base. I got one right near the street, so we already got your tag. Folks, it was a Jeep that had uh, some silk screen 813 number on the back. Folks, we're going to give them a call later and ask them what the hell they were parked out in front of our house. People aren't going to... That's right, they got to go. That's me. I'm the whistleblower, lady. I'm, that's me. That's me. I'm Sergeant Grizzlegritz. These people are so wicked. Uh, look at these people right here. Look at these people in these little Jeeps. Just look at this guy right here. Hey, folks, don't take my word for it. Some, something with this Jeep club. There was a Jeep parked out in front of my house yesterday when I was down in Lee County, folks. These people got all these little weird duckies and sh stuff in there. It, it don't make sense to me. It's perverted. I just know it. That's right, brother. That's right, friend. Help's on the way. Help's on the way. Oh, these people are despicable. Sir, sir, right here. That's me. People are so despicable. Folks, we're not scared anymore. We're not scared anymore. They gotta go. They gotta go. They gotta get out of here. We got rid of Paul Russo. He's gone. We're going after her next. And her. Get out of here. Get out of here. That's right. That's right. Folks, we're not playing around. Peacefully, peacefully, friends. Everything's peaceful. That's right, friend. We're taking back our government peacefully. We're going to make these demons resign. That's right. That's right. That's right. Oh, it's windy out here, folks. That's right, sir. That's right. What's this crazy man doing out here? Folks, I'm not crazy. I'm a, I'm a combat veteran. We demand better. That's right. We demand better. We demand resonations. We demand resonations. We demand resonations, lady. Oh, the demons. Folks, the demons are coming by. You can just tell. They look at you with that look of stuff. They're, 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 they're afraid. Folks, these people are scared. You got to repent. There's another Jeep. What's going on with these Jeeps? Look, if you got a Jeep and it ain't got some mud on it, just go get a car. Right, that's right. We're getting rid of these people. Oh, that's definitely a pervert there. I don't know, friends. What do y'all think? A guy like that in an ice cream truck? My, uh, Mr. Grizzle. Sergeant Grizzle, course, his daddy told him always stay away from those type of people. That's right. We're taking it back, sir. We're taking it back. Look, friends, they're going to run me over. God's already told me a car is going to come out and get me. Hopefully I can get over here to this concrete before I get run over. These people are demonic, folks. They don't want me out here. 
and they're scared. And listen, when they get scared, they do bad things and they, they, they turn to violence because they're undisciplined, folks. We don't want any violence because we got righteousness on our side. Folks, isn't that awesome when you don't lie and you document things and then you can sue these folks? There's no resonations. Go to the website, friends. I did a transmission last night. Everything that these horrible people did to my family, I talked about. Oh, Miss Grizzle Grits, you gotta log off. Look, folks, they turned Miss Grizzle Grits on me. She tried to get me Baker acted the other day. It's so horrible. Miss Grizzle Grits, just log off. I, I can't I can't deal with you right now. Trade friends. We're taking back our VA peacefully. Hey! That's right. Oh, these people are so wicked. Look, we demand resonations by the end of the day. All the evidence, look, we put Miss uh, Justina Wells, you're, 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 we, did a, we did a FOIA request. And when you did the interview, ma'am, you rated me a 0, 0.0. Folks, the scale was a one to five. She did it because I was white. She was trying to prove herself to these demons because she wants to be the next director, folks, and they were already lining her up to be the next director. And listen, Miss Chris Brown, they're, they're gonna make you resign because they're gonna put a, they're gonna, listen, they're gonna take advantage of that opportunity, ma'am. You're not. Listen, they're gonna put a lady of color in there. You know this. Good grief. They're just waiting. They're just waiting for a reason to get rid of you. Now they got one. Folks, we gotta keep these people on their toes. Again, help really won't be. We won't get help until until Trumpster gets back in there. So we can fire all these demons. These people are so despicable. Listen, friends, I'll just I'll just hang out with a veteran out here. Gentleman had a little legal problems, alright? And as long as you didn't harm children, listen, if you're a pedophile, you shouldn't even get any care at the VA. I, I don't think that gentleman was. Like all of us, we get we get in a little trouble because we don't get the help we need. But the VA has turned the back on this gentleman. It's despicable how they're treating our, our, our veterans. This man needs some help. He's homeless. And these perverts are up in the pentad. Look, folks, I'm not making it up. Go to the website. Right over there across those trees. They're having pajama parties, friends. It's demonic. It's, it's despicable. I demand every single one of those people in pajamas resign today. And you should call the Congress, folks. Call Byron Donald's office in Lee County. Look, friends, I know you logged on. You were a good fister. Call your Congress people where you live. Say, hey, we got to stop the DEI madness. It's, it's outrageous, folks. Listen, friends, I'm not kidding you. We ain't got no more fish oil. I don't know what. Oh, good grief. I don't know how I'm going to react with no fish oil. Right, brother. Look. Sir, go get that truck looked at. That, that don't sound good, sir. These people. Oh, you know, friends, the best part. Hey, that's right, friends. We're getting rid of them. Friends, the best part is when we um, we get to stand out here at the end of the day when these demons flee the ship. And these rats. These rats aren't even from the area. All you gotta do is look at the tags. They're all from liberal states. That's right. That's right, folks. That's right. You gotta look up really. Uh, you people are horrible. That's right, friend. I'm talking to you, ma'am. Stop, har stop harming our veterans. I know you are. You can just look at these people, folks. Because they look away. They don't want to see what excellence looks like. Because they know they're in there harming our veterans. And they got somebody out here calling them out on it, folks. I can't I can't step foot on that property. Folks, I'm a veteran. I'm supposed to get my care there. And I'm not even allowed on there. They'll throw me in jail. I'll be up there with all the January 6th people. It's despicable. It's despicable what these people are doing. That's right, sir. You know, you know what's going on in this place. Folks, this is costing me my health. Last time we were out here, we got rid of the last demonic lady. Oh, but she's at the regional office now. Good grief, folks. That's right, friends. You got to go to the website. Friends, go go to the go to the YouTube. We did a transmission last night. I got all, folks. What these people did to Mr. Trump and his books is so despicable. Just go, just go look at the transmissions on YouTube. Look, it's a little lengthy, but there's a lot of information in there. Folks, we got to sue these people. It's so easy. Listen, it's so easy. Just document it. All you got to do is. Oh, here's another person. Look at these people. Look at these perverted people. Folks, I'm telling you, there's something with the rubber duckies. I, I don't understand it, but I know it's bad. Because these people were parked outside of my house yesterday. That's right, Miss Grizzle Grits. That's why you got to stop leaving all the doors unlocked. We're getting rid of them. That's right, you buddy. Talking to you. Talking to you, lady. People make me sick. Talking to you, sir. You need to get out of here. These people are so horrible. Folks, there's not one ounce of leadership in this place. They all got rid of it when they got rid of me and the last guy. I hate to say it. 
They don't want leaders in there, folks. They want people that follow orders. They're, there's no leaders. They're just following orders from the vision. The vision getting orders from the central office. Folks, I hate to tell you, that's coming from the secretary. Folks, I got all the emails. We turned it over to Congress. These people can't hide from it no more. I told y'all not to mess around. Good grief. Here's our sheriff's deputy. Looks, Pinellas County, we forgot to call you. Sorry, we just got a little tied up today, but we're not doing anything wrong, and I know y'all know we're not doing anything wrong. Well, well, let's just stand back. We don't want to impede any traffic, and you know we got to make sure we're doing the right thing here. Folks, these people don't do the right thing. They lied in investigations. They lied into an investigation, into, and to me, I asked for that investigation, and they lied. They used it to try to remove me from my job. And then when I had a mental relapse, folks, I'm combat. I don't have to explain it to you. I don't have to. If I have to explain it to you, you would never understand. Folks, they drove me to the point where I had a, I had a panic attack and, and a mental breakdown in my office. Folks, I demanded FMLA that the next work day, and they lied. They said I went AWOL. They told that to two congressional offices, that I was AWOL, folks. AWOL is the most despicable thing you could ever do. That means you're a deserter. These people are so despicable. I want to use some profanity, but God forbids me to do that, friends, because I'm, I'm righteous and I'm disciplined now. That's right. They're going. Out of here. We got to get rid of this, this DEI nonsense, folks. It ain't working. You know it ain't working. The University of Florida, they got rid of all their, they got rid of all the DEI staff. Folks, listen, we gotta get rid of the DNI. It ain't working. It's harming people. Good people are killing themselves, for goodness sakes. This place, Mr. Paul Russo took it from a four star down to a one. Folks, that was by design. That was by design they did it from a four to a one. Folks, they wanna kill us all. They want us to be discouraged. They want us to just go home and kill ourselves, folks. They tried to do it to me, but I, I refused. Even Miss Grizzlegrits wanted me to just sit around and clean the house, and I wasn't gonna do that. Oh, these people are despicable, folks. So despicable. Look, look, there ain't no VA police today because they, they're under strict orders to not harass me anymore. All right, see? Look, they just keep on going because there ain't no problem here, folks. The sheriff just keeps going. Right, friends? Folks, listen, we, we got to get we gotta get out here. We got to demand action. If you're not a veteran, I know you know someone that is. Just go ask your family member who's a veteran. Ask them how they think about the VA. We don't like it. I don't think we've ever liked it, but it's so bad now. I won't even use the VA anymore, folks. I'll just take my chances because I'm righteous and I'm healthy. But goodness gracious, friends, I need my fish oil. Look, they're taking away from, from us and they're giving it to the tangos, brother. I'm not kidding you. Look, we don't understand those things. It ain't for us to understand. That's between them and God. But look, if y'all are harming children, because listen, folks, I hate to say it. These people are perverted. Not, not all the tangos, not all of them. There's a lot of these people. They want to harm children, folks. Look at these. These people are so angry. This place is nothing but hatred and demonic. We're getting rid of them, man. They're going away. The VA, they're out of here. You're fired. Mr. Trumpster, I, I know you're going to get this message someday because we're working with some righteous people in Congress. And they were over at your, your fabulous Mar-a-Lago the other, earlier this week, sir. Sir, I know you're going to get this transmission. Sir, I would love personally for you to come down here when you get in office. Sir, I will. we will go to all these demonic places and we'll go one by one and fire each of these people, sir. It'd be my pleasure to do that. Sir, what they did to your beautiful books. Folks, I'm not kidding. There's, there's a police report. Just go ask. I'll get the dates for you. Sometime in August last year. They threw all the books in the dumpster because they don't like us and they don't want nothing to do with us. That's wrong. For, friends, that's wrong. That was property that somebody donated. It's logged. I, I logged it, folks. They, they, destroyed, they destroyed property. And I'm the one that got in trouble for asking the questions. It's so demonic. All these people are horrible. That's right, sir. We're getting rid of them. They're horrible. They fired me for being a white guy. Can you believe it? Hey, right here. Sir, go to the website. We're suing. The, we're going to sue the demonic man pants off these demonic women in here. Folks, the union's running this place. I hate to tell you. That's why they got a sorry excuse for a leader as a director. Folks, they got their hands so far up as River Ran. They're just making them do all these horrible things. He didn't know Sergeant Grizzle Gritz was AWOL. He thought I was AWOL. He was lied to by these women. Chris Brown, you better be gone by the end of the day, ma'am. You got to go. Please, ma'am, I, I know you, ma'am, you're a family lady. You should know better than this. You got grandkids, for goodness sake. You're not going to escape this, ma'am. You're going to go before Congress. They're going to ask you why you did this to a righteous guy like Sergeant Grizzlegrits. And they're going to look at the evidence, and they're going to demand why you followed illegal orders. And you fired me illegally, ma'am. That letter, we got the letter. It's going on the website tonight, ma'am. We just got to make some redactions. We're not going to do a redactions like you did us. Folks, we asked for FOIA. Folks, we got like 28 pages out of 1,500. But it was enough. Even, even that little bit was enough to, to put all the charges on these folks. Listen, lady. We're going to get... 
We're gonna get the full unredacted one. Don't you worry. Congress is already working on that. Oh, good lord, lady. You don't know the mess you got yourself into. You gotta stop the madness. That's right, folks. People are bad. These people are bad. Listen, folks. I'm glad they didn't give me my fish oil because I'd probably still be at home right now. But it just takes that little effort just to put you... Well, to get you that motivation. And we're not going to say the other word because then they'll have the suicide wrenching lady come out here again. Folks, they stopped harassing me when I told them Congress is looking into you. That's right. These people are sick and tired of it. Sick and tired of being tra trampled off. Folks, we don't ask for a lot. Goodness gracious. All the veterans that are logged on right now, you know exactly what I'm talking about. You know, we got, we're, like, we're like convicts. We got to prove... We gotta prove the fact that we served overseas. We gotta prove our, I mean, it, it takes like a year to get your benefits. This is ridiculous. Folks, we gotta stop paying our taxes until this mess gets squared away. Look at these people. All these people from New York, they don't like us. Look at that lady just stared at me with a disgust in her face. That's right, brother, that's right. The wrong, oh, there's no wrong. Lord, I almost used up her vanity. Don't let me do it, Lord. I'm, I'm disciplined, I'm highly trained. Friends, I'm highly trained in all manners of fire support, love language, and evasion tactics. Don't come find Sergeant Grizzle Grits. It won't work out good for you. That's right, friend. That's right. They gotta go. They gotta go. We're gonna give them the old boot. So, hey, look, we're gonna do it peacefully. We're not. We're not really gonna put a boot up someone's rear end. It's gonna be peaceful, folks. Everything here's peaceful. It's a metaphor for all you lizard people. These people right here. That's right. That's right. That's right, sir. Honk your horn. Honk your horn, lady. Well, you better just keep your hands on the steering wheel. You look like you're a bad driver. Good grief, folks. This is outrageous what's going on here. Listen, friends, you got to get out here with me. You know, we're going we're gonna to be we're gonna be out here next next week. It's, hey, listen, we're not going to come out here on the weekends because all these demons, they, they fly back up north, folks. They, I, I can't make this stuff up. They don't hang out down here. Friends, we're going to be back out here on Monday. Then we're going to go back down to Lee County. We already got some people going to join us next week, folks. It's a movement. You got to get out here. Call in. Hey, Mike. Oh, you're a good friend. I'm sorry we hadn't talked in a while, friend. Look, brother, the VAs, they fired me for being a white guy. I got them on eight charges. We're suing them. The lady, Justina Wells, go to the website. That's her evidence. The lady rated me on a scale of one to five. Friends, they, she gave me a 0.0, .0 on, on several of the questions. That's illegal. That's illegal, friends. You can't do that. That's harassment. It's discrimination. If it happened to a black guy, I'd, I'd be out here too, friends, if I had the evidence. Y'all know me, you know I'm like that. Saying about color, we got to get competent people back in there, friends, because we're going to all die in this World War III nonsense. Listen, friends, I, I, I couldn't even stand watching that old man last night. You know, the State of Union is supposed to start at 9 o'clock. What time did that guy, what, what time did they drag him out there? I know it wasn't 9 o'clock. It was like 20 minutes after. Folks, we got to wake up. This is despicable. I don't like that guy, but what they're doing to him is bad, too. He's, he's an old man, you know? Trust me, God's already got. A, God's already told me. This guy ain't going to heaven. We know that. That's right. That's right. Friends, listen. You got, you got to stop being afraid. You know, you got to get out of here. Friend, I, I know you're in Denver. I, I think you're still there. That's right, friend. It's all about... It ain't about color, friend. It ain't about color. It's about us. Friends, we got to go out to that Denver facility. You know what? Sergeant Grizzle Grits knows some righteous people out there. I was out there last year, friends. I get a tour of the facility. <coughs> it's been... It's, the VA's been overtaken by demonic forces. Again, folks, it ain't about gays or tangos or whatever. It's about veterans. We're all veterans. I don't care what you identify in the bedroom. These people want to know. They got us on a list. Y'all know that. That's why I don't got my fish oil. If I told them that I did some, some things... Listen, folks, I don't need to go there. People aren't doing us right. We know that. He's not doing us right. That's right, brother. That's right. See, I'm telling you, folks, it ain't about color. Good grief. People are smarter than that. Stop, stop manipulating these good people. These people see right past that manipulation. Good grief. That's right. That's right. I'm talking to you, lady, with a little dog in your car. It's okay. Listen, folks, Sergeant Grizzle Grits had two little dogs, and they're all in doggy heaven now, but... That's right. It's all true, folks. Listen, that's, that's why God picked Sergeant Grizzle Grits. Because I've been a doormat for far too long. Folks, so many of y'all done me so horrible. Y'all done me so bad. But I didn't complain. I learned from all those horrible lessons. And I don't blame you. Because look, it's, this is a lot. Listen, folks, this is a lot. To, this is a lot to try to understand here in a little clip. 
But you see, I've been paying attention to this stuff for like 10 years, and it's just been building and building and getting worse. And, that, and now it can't, they, this, this madness came and got Sergeant Grizzle Grits and it got his family. Now we just can't sit at home and we can't play Call of Duty no more, friends. Friends, there's so many good players dying in the war zone, but they're just going to have to die and respawn. So this is just a little more important. Uh-oh. Look, see, folks, these people are angry. Wow, lady. Folks, that lady has a perverted... Look, listen to that car. See, this one I'm talking about ladies. She get rid of all the strong men. That lady had a perverted Disney, Disney tag on her car. She has children, and she's got them plugged into the perversions. And her car sounds like it needed to be in the auto shop, like, many, many, many miles ago. But man, listen, ladies, when you get rid of the strong men, they're not going to tell you, hey, you got to put a little air in your tire. Miss Grizzle Grits, go check your air. Because you, uh, you run those things on, well, there's 10% there's like air in it, lady, and you got the children in the van. Just go, go get some air. Y'all women got to stop this madness. You know, there's a reason why God made us strong. Listen. Man, oh man, listen. Men, we got to be men again, all right? There's ladies laughing. These, these, these demons, I'm telling you. Look at these demons out here. That's right, brother. Ladies, if you, if you keep getting rid of all the strong men, you're not gonna have any. You're not gonna have any men. All right, you're gonna have a bunch of girly men. And I know too many good men that have turned into girly men. Folks, that's what they want. They want to control. They're the to this place. Look, I'm not making this up. They got a. They got a, a sourpuss. Sorry, excuse for a man as the director, Paul Russo. And they, those women over there, just literally, I mean, they violated this man. They, they were so up in his colon. They, they had their hand all the way up in his mouth. It's despicable what these people have done. And again, oh, these people think it's funny. That's fine. Look, these people don't put their ass on the line. They're, 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 the, they're what we call the effing civilians, folks. I'm, I'm sorry to say it. There's, there, there's only three type of people in our country, and you know what it is because you heard me say it. You got the veterans. You got the guys like, out, like me. I'm out here putting a little skin in the game. You got all the folks that got to go back to work. They're on their lunch break. They're honking the horn in support. And then you got the effing civilians. Friends, I won't say that word anymore. I'm righteous. And God wouldn't like me using profanity because we can get the point across without using bad words. That's right, friend. Folks, those people, they don't care about our country. They're the civilians. They just want to take, 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 and they don't want to They don't want to help us keep it. And listen, they're weak, and they're going to be the first ones to go in this nightmare. Because they're all plugged in, and they... They're, they're on the government dime, and you know they're they're they're, they're not they're not doing righteous stuff. They're being perverted, and they're harming children, folks. That's right, sir. That's right. We're gonna have to give them the old boot, the metaphoric boot. We don't want no problems. Oh. That's right. That's, that, that's right. That's what I'm talking about. See, people people know what's going on here. So for you demons that keep driving by, flipping me off, keep doing it. You're giving me inspiration. Cause I'm gonna be out here every day until y'all are gone. That's right. That's right. People are so despicable, man. You know, you know, this is despicable. Friends, I need you out here. The more people we get out here, the quicker Sergeant Grizzle Grits can go back to playing Call of Duty. But listen, I'm not going to play it if they're going to keep putting the demon, demonic pentagram crap in there. Folks, they're coming after us everywhere. I mean, friends, don't watch any kiddie shows 2016 and newer. I hate to tell you, it ain't what you think it is. If you got the rainbow unicorns in your house, you gotta go look up what that what that really means. <coughs> folks, it's, it, folks, it's perverted. Folks, it's it's something that the men do with each other in the bedroom, or apparently they do it on the uh, at the parades. I, I, folks, I can't make this stuff up. Folks, they do these demon things at these pride parades. They have sex on the floats. They put a little skittles in their mouth. Sir, we're going after the director. He retired. He's resigned, sir. Right here. They fired me for being a white guy. That's right, it's all true. Is that Gordy? SergeantGrizzleGrits.com. Is that Jan? I used to be your boss over there, if that's you, ma'am. I was the assistant chief, it's Ron. Ma'am, they fired me, you know they did. Go to the website, Gordy, I know you know it. They got rid of me. I think that's you, I don't know, but look, sir. Welcome to Florida. They're doing bad things in here, sir. Call your congressman, sir. We're working with the oversight committee. We're getting resignations. That's right, buddy. That's right. Folks, listen. Folks, we gotta we gotta do this peacefully. These people don't play fair. That's why there's a lot of good people locked up for that January 6th incident. Folks, they were led in that building. We all know that. We were lied to. <coughs> people like Liz Cheney, they're they're not on our side, folks. Listen. 
There's a despicable state senator, state representative. You know who you are, sir. You used to be my boss down in Lee County. Sir, nobody likes you. You're despicable. And you, you are one of these lizard people. Now, I'm not going to tell you how I know, but I know. Trust me, friend. I got the gift. I know you're part of the... You're cut from that same perverted cloth. Sir, they don't like you. I'm not going to tell people who you are, but you know who you are, sir. We're just going to call you Mr. Cucaracha because you're a cockroach. And you're, you're just like the Liz Cheney's. You know, you, you come in there, you act like you're a Republican. You, you worm your way in there. Sir, you were a JAG officer. That's not honorable. You went after service members. Sir, that's why the people, when they came up to the office, they wanted to talk to the veteran. They didn't go to your office. They came into mine, sir. These people are despicable. And sir, look, I'm sorry. You're not going to jump on the Trump train. We've already, I don't think you're going to, they know who you are, buddy. Go, go call Liz Cheney. Maybe you can go hang out with her. Or maybe Nikki Haley. These people are despicable. Folks, we're going to start calling the spades, spades, and aces, aces. We're not, we're going to do it respectfully. But look, the shenanigans are over. Too much harm's been caused. That's right, buddy. That's right. Look at these people. That's right, friend. These people, these people want to know what's going on, friend. That's right, buddy. That's right. Go to the website, sir. Go to the website. Everything's there. Friends, I want y'all to record me. This is why I'm out here. If I don't want to be recorded, I'd be at home playing Call of Duty. Because in Call of Duty, you can you can hide behind a little player in the game, and nobody has to know who you are. That's right, friend. That's a good patron right here. Look, you got look at this guy. This guy's just he's just screaming patriot on that vehicle. I love it. That's right. That's right, friends. Oh, these people. Look at that lady over there. Sir, we're, get, we're getting resonations. Help's on the way. Help's on the way, brother. Folks, these people have never seen anything like this. Man, they're in shock. Get your cameras out. I mean, goodness gracious. Look what they drove us to. They took our fish all away. Look at this. There's homeless veterans out here. And these people are having pajama parties up, up in the, uh, the demonic pentad. Folks, why don't they call it the executive leadership ward? It's because they're demonic. They call it the pentad, folks. That's the first thing I asked my boss. Why do they call it the pentad? He explained, well, there's five of them. Well, friends, there's five points on a pentagram. And if you turn the little star a certain way, it's the pentagram. Good grace. Do I got to explain all this to y'all? Folks, these people are demonic. They got the stickers on their cars. I don't judge people, but when you come after me and you harm veterans, then we got to come out here. You know, you need to leave that witchcraft at your little apartment that you're written. Because we know y'all aren't from the area. Y'all are all handpicked and sit down here. Good grief, folks. These people don't even have homestead exemption down here. Because they're not residents. They come down here and they destroy a facility, and then when they get, then they get in trouble, they, they just resign or they put them in another place. Listen, listen, you demons at the VA, talking about you demons up in DC. I know y'all already got someone handpicked to come down here, cause you already had that person picked a while ago, cause you knew this guy was gonna have to go at some point. But we're we're gonna do our due due diligence on that person too. We're gonna dig in their past. That's right. You didn't understand this, but Sergeant Crystal Gritz has a righteous guy. He does all his background work, and oh, he's plugged in, folks. Don't hey, this guy works for the State Department. Don't, don't, don't test this, folks. Please stop it. We already know who you folks are. That's right, ma'am. It's all horrible. We got rid of your director, ma'am. These people just don't know. You gotta stop harming us. You gotta stop harming us, friends. We don't ask for a lot. Goodness gracious, we just expect. You know, we don't expect the best care, but at least give us a little bit of care. And stop taking my fish oil away, folks. I, someone call the congressman right now. Somebody call the congressman. Tell him that I haven't had my fish oil in over a week. I don't know what the side effects are. Goodness gracious. You know, the lady, Dr. Kaputsky, oh, that lady's so horrible down in this Bradington Seabock. Man, we're going to we're gonna go down there and do a little peaceful protest. Folks, y'all know this lady denied me my Family Medical Leave Act? This lady looked me in the face. I begged her, folks. I begged this lady. I said, you can't send me back to work, what these people did to me. She said, nope, you're going back to work on Monday. And I said, ma'am, that's illegal. You can't do that. She said, nope, you're going back to work. So she ended the call that I called a primary care in the civilian sector. Folks, I met with that guy. That man's righteous because he helped me with some marital problems in the past. This guy has so much pity, he went ahead and just signed all the paperwork. Folks, that's why these people can't get away with this stuff. You gotta unplug from the VA. They're all demonic. What's going on, ma'am? <coughs> oh, good grief. It's windy out here. How you doing, ma'am? Hi. What's this about? Well, here you go. You can have a business card. We got some demons in there, ma'am. Um, I'm a white guy. They fired me for being a white guy. Have you ever gone to voluntary service over there to get food or anything? 
I worked at voluntary service. You remember who, uh, I can't say it because we're live. Remember the little guy that used to work there? Ma'am, I was your assistant chief of voluntary service. They illegally removed me last year for being a white guy. We got them on eight charges. We're suing them. Ma'am, I'm a whistleblower. I'm working with Congress. I'm demanding, Paul Russo's already resigned. We're demanding Chris Brown. She was my supervisor. She's the one that did this to my family. We're, we're demanding Justina Wells. This lady rated me a 0.0 on a scale of one to five. Ma'am, one to five. For what? Because I'm a white guy. I was doing an interview for the chief job. She had to make sure that she let the demons know. Ma'am, this lady wants to be the new director. A 0, 0.0 on a is scale of one to five. Just, I, I'm not going to say all those things, but just figure it out. It, 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 what do you mean we're live? I got Facebook going here, ma'am. So. Oh, hi, Facebook. Right, look. Well, I'm glad people stand up for what's right. Ma'am, I'm a gold star well. family. My, my brother-in-law died in the war. I did 20 years. I've been to Afghanistan so many times. It's so despicable. These people got to start. Hey, what's up, my righteous brother? These people it's don't like me. It's all right. Uh, turn it to these people. Well, so people know why I'm out here. Uh, they, they know why I'm out here. Because all they got to do is just turn on the news. Well. You doing all right today? Hey, stay safe, brother. I'm praying for you. Demons in there. You go to the website yet? Yeah, Look, I don't hate the gays. They're, they're lying, brother. It ain't about that. It ain't about that at all, man. I, I demand accountability in there. You know that? Aren't you burning up? Are you up? in third, third battalion? Yeah. Aren't you burning Stuart? up? Stuart, right? I demoed out of there. My first tour with National Guard would do it. You need a break? Oh, I got it, man. Aren't you burning up? No, oh, I'm a soldier, man. I appreciate it. All right, brother. I'm praying for you. Stop the mind control. I know you know about it. These people are under a spell in there, man. Are you a veteran too? I'm a vet. What did you do? Air Force, air oh, traffic yeah. control. Oh, Four man. Four years, three months, 18 days. Were you there when Ronald Reagan had that little problem with the air traffic controller? That's when I got out. <laughs> I got out and, and, and couldn't get it. Couldn't, yeah, I had a Oh, Man, we got to get our, our, our countries in such a mess right now. And, and this is what God compelled me to come out here and do this. I got so much evidence on these people, ma'am. It involves the director, the deputy director. It involves the senior HR folks. It involves the union. The union's been running this place. It, it, they, right. buy, they have violated so many laws. These people all need to go to jail. And I'm going to demand it because we're working with Congress. Man. It's horrible. Let's go to the website. I will. I will. I got to eat some because I have a three o'clock. Wait. Go grab some shade, man. Over there, the, um, maybe the bitch. I'd, I'd offer you some water, but I gave my last water to another righteous veteran. That's out here on the streets, folks. Look, I'm, I'm highly trained, ma'am. Look at this. We do a thing called PMCS before we come out here. We make sure all our gear is ready to go and I'm good to go. But I appreciate it. I have this little. You keep that. Mm. This is good water from the fire base. Ma'am, would you like to pray real quick with us? Are you, are you? Oh, I'm a Christian. I talk to God. I love Jesus. Listen, friends, this is what I'm talking about. Ma'am, hold on to my arm when you get a minute. We're going to pray that the demons release their spell from this place. In the name, just hold on to my arm right here. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, we command the demons to release their grip on Bay Pines PA. Lord, we got one of you demons to resign the other day. Lord Jesus, we demand all the other resignations in the day, Lord. We're good people. We don't ask for a lot. There's a righteous lady out here, a righteous Air Force air driver controller lady. She don't need to be out here. She needs to get all the care she needs, Lord. Lord Jesus, we need our fish oil. In the name of Jesus, I command you to release the demons. In Jesus' name, amen. Demons out here, Lord. We got to get the I demons. I stand against them. Right. I, we stand in agreement against the demons that are doing controlling oh. in the veterans' business. That's right. Lord, this is awful. This is our VA. We stand together in agreement that they be destroyed. Go back to hell, demons. Go back to hell. That's right. Go back to hell. Amen. Amen, ma'am. Oh, that's right. Listen, I came out here and I got on my knees over there and prayed. And the director resigned later that night. So prayer works, ma'am. Prayer works, hallelujah. I know it does. Go get you some shade, ma'am, and hydrate. We got to keep ourselves hydrated. Even you, even you nice Air Force ladies. Oh, I left my nice watch at the house. I was in such a hurry to get out here today do some righteousness. Oh, man, it's 2 o'clock and I have a 3 I'm not worried about time, friends, because... Oh, man, you always got time to eat. You got to be over there at 3? Yeah. Just grab some shade. Maybe, oh, there's a bench over there. The little... Oh, oh. 
This place isn't open. Village Inn is open, ma'am. Maybe go get you. Oh, okay. There you go. All right, go get some water, man. We need to hydrate. Listen, friends, what I'm talking about. You know, stop being afraid. Listen, I, this, every time I meet somebody out here, we pray, and these people start resigning. That's right, friend. That's right. We're not afraid. Hey, they're resigning, my buddy. These people are so wicked. Folks, you gotta pray, and you gotta be you gotta be specific when you pray. When I was trying to get rid of the alcohol, I, I asked God to take the, take the alcohol from me, God, and He did. Goodness gracious, you just gotta pray. Mrs. Grizzlegrits, we're praying for you. We know you got a de demonic spell on you, ma'am. You just gotta pray. People are so rotten. They got no business running a place like this. They ran it to the ground, folks. That's why they're resigning. But we demand resignations. You don't get to keep your <coughs> you don't get to keep your retirement, friends. Friends, they didn't give Sergeant Grizzlegrits retirement. And in fact, if I had listened to Mrs. Grizzlegrits, my unemployment would have run out a few weeks ago. Folks, we demand better. This is outrageous. And the most despicable thing, folks, there's so many there's so many good people that were drafted in the Vietnam War and they're out here homeless. And these people just keep kicking them. We demand resonations. We demand competent leaders that actually care about our veterans. That's right, friends. Look at you. I'm talking to you, ma'am, right there. That's right. Pop that horn, buddy. That's right. I'm talking to you, sir. I told you, friends, there's something with the Jeeps and the perversions. Folks, I ain't making this stuff up. There's something with the Jeeps and the little duckies in there, folks. God gives me, God, stop testing me, people. God gave me a gift. Listen, friends, oh, this person's coming for an interview. Look, I told you, friends, I told you. Listen up, you little perverts in your little Jeep club. You better stay away from the fire base. That's right, brother, that's right. Because what y'all don't know is I live in a neighborhood where there's a lot of elderly folks. And they don't work because they're retired. And, and they're out there pulling security up for Sergeant Grizzle Grits. So don't you mess around when I'm out here doing righteousness. So I'll have the sheriffs over there to find out what you're up to. Folks, I'm telling you, somebody help me understand what's up with the Jeeps. They got the little duckies on the windshield. I don't get, I don't understand it, folks. Maybe it's nothing, but listen, one of those folks are outside of my house yesterday. And there's a whole, oh, folks, there's a whole chapter of these demons that work here. Of course, because it's all demonic. What is up with these perverts in the Jeeps? Folks, it makes sense, doesn't it? If you are a perverted person, wouldn't you want to come work here because you're protected and you can harm veterans and get away with it? Listen up, you perverted people. Those days are done. They're numbered. We're going to hold your feet to the fire until Trumpster can get in there and just fire all you demonic people. <coughs> Trust me, I already told them who needs to go. Sir, you diversity hire that came out here to laugh at me. Sir, you're going to. I'm sorry to tell you. We already know who you are. Listen, Congress already has a file on you, buddy. You need to go ahead and contact the Congressional Office. Come clean. You're going to be in front of Congress. You're going to explain what you did, sir. Oh, gosh. We got you on. Oh, buddy. I didn't even want to get into it. Don't come out here and laugh at me, sir. I mean, God's righteous. He's going to make sure the right thing's done. These people. They're done. We gotta go. My brother's here. Hey, you. Right? Hey! I'm looking at you, buddy. Don't laugh at me. 
laugh at me. You laugh at me all you want. God, that righteousness of all those people. Look, sir, it's all true. Hey, buddy. Talking to you. Talking to you right there, friend. Right up here. You gotta read it. Look, friends, just come out here and videotape me. I don't care if you're videotaping me. It don't bother me one bit. That's why I'm out here. Good grief. You don't got to drive by and act like you're being inconspicuous video recording me. Folks, she looks silly. Right, man. <coughs> right. Looking at you. I'm looking at you, buddy. That's right. Look at that lady right there. That's right, sir. That's right. We got to stop the madness. You. Oh. Oh, look at these, look at these demons over there. There's demons. Police are a joke. The VA police are a joke. Is that right, buddy? Look at these demons here, look at them. Look at these demons right here. Look at these demons. What's up, brother? That guy's not a demon. That guy's a righteous dude. Look, you just gotta point at these folks. There's a righteous guy right here. I think that guy, he works in the electric shop. I've met you, sir, you have, we've had many talks. Folks, these are real people. There's like a lot of good people here. But they're under this demonic spell. Because look, these, these folks can't afford to lose their jobs, folks. The economy's too horrible. Good grief. I can't even go buy fish oil on the market because it's just too expensive. That's right. Take a picture. Hey, help's on the way. Oh, God, I'm losing my voice. Jesus, help me just get through this afternoon. That way I can have two days of rest. Two days for my voice to come back, if it ever does. Good grief. Listen, folks, this is why I, this is why I understand Mr. Alex Jones talks the way he does. Good Lord. But he was handpicked by God, too. I just was a little later on down the road. That's right, friend. That's right. That's right. That's right. You, buddy, I'm talking to you. Folks, we can't be afraid anymore. These people are weak. That's why they gotta lie. That's why they gotta call the sheriffs out here. They can't even come out here themselves. Folks, they know they're a joke. They know, look at that righteous lady. That was a good looking lady there, ma'am. That's right, ma'am. I'm, I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you. That's a big boat, sir. That's a big boat. Oh, look at that boat. I'm talking to you, buddy. I'm talking to you, ma'am. Hey. Look over here, that's why I'm out here. Oh, look at the guy. Folks, did I tell you, look at the demons flicking me off. Look at the girly man in the little girly minivan. Sir, you look like you needed an oil change a couple thousand miles ago, but you wouldn't know that because you're demonic. Folks, these people, I'm not making this stuff up. Why would anyone be flicking me off out here? Folks, that's why we gotta get out here. We, these demons don't control our government. That's right, friend, that's right. We're gonna send these demons back to hell peacefully, folks, peacefully. Look, you can't harm children, and you better not harm the veterans. Folks, look, it's a stunt. I'm not going to harm myself, but there's a reason why I'm out here in body armor. These people are real. They're probably going to wind up trying to shoot me, folks. But listen, what y'all don't understand is I got the I got the deployment body armor. That's right, Sergeant Grizzle Grits. Well, they didn't ask for it back, and it just became part of the collection. Folks, we got the sappy plates. We got the real deal, folks. This thing will stop. Well, it'll stop at 7.62. Right, friend. Smoking's bad for you, but I like it. Hey, brother, you're not going to that demonic VA, are you? That's right. Stay out of there. They'll, they'll convince you you're a transgender, and they'll take your fish all the way. It's so demonic, folks. Hey! Look at this lady here. Ma'am, it's all right. We don't need to wear the mask. The COVID's gone. We don't need to wear the mask, ma'am. Oh, I'm so sorry, man. I, I, I don't mean to pass judgment. There's just so much wrong going on in this VA. They're, they're so despicable. Really? Oh, my gosh. Man. Take a business. Here, take a few business cards. It's a movement. Just take one. Give them a friend. Ma'am, I'm a whistleblower. 
I used to work, ma'am, I still work there. I'm on the books. They fired me for being a white guy. I'm still an employee in this place. I'm on the books. You ever heard of diversity, equity, and inclusion? Go look it up, ma'am. They're, they're using it to get rid of all the white men. And, and the director just resigned, and we're demanding more resignations for what they did here, folks. Listen, folks, I'm sorry I judged that lady. She, she's got a health condition, but look, so many of y'all are still wearing the mask. You got to take it off. God wants you to treat, he wants you to get some fresh air. That's why we're out here. Folks, I'll tell you what, look at these folks. Is this, this is friendly or food? Well, he's definitely not a friendly. That's right, friend. That's right. Look at these demons. Hey, film me, buddy. Film me. That's right. Look at these demons. Flick me off. I love it. That's right, my righteous brother. Oh, he's on his phone. Sir, it. These people are going to crash into me. That's right, ma'am. That's right, lady. I'm looking at you. Look at these people. Goodness gracious. I told you, folks, stop doubting me. These people are demonic. And the, the demons are in there. We got to get them out of there. That's right, sir. Folks, it's called the Pentad. It's demonic. I've been up there. Trust me, folks. They didn't like me. You don't have to believe me, folks, but these people have demons in them. The demons didn't like the righteousness in me, and they treated me horribly, folks. That's right. That's right, lady. All these righteous people. That's right, ma'am. That's right. You know, oh, I'm looking lady there, ma'am. Mrs. Grizzlegrits, like you shouldn't have messed around. You, you know, you, you got rid of a righteous dude. And there's not that many. There's not many of us left, ladies. That's why when Sergeant Grizzlegrits gets back in the dating game, we're gonna be so highly selective because we gotta have somebody we can trust, somebody who's in tune to righteousness and not just taken. We're not gonna, oh, hell, look. There's the incompetent, perverted VA police officers, folks. Folks, these people got caught having sex in their squad car. I can't make this stuff up, folks. Look at them. Now, again, folks, there's some good people out there. Sergeant Grizzlegrits knows a lot of fine men and women. And look, there's even a. Listen, there's a lot of good police officers over there. And, and, and ma'am, sir, I don't, I don't even know what to say, but you're, you're a righteous person. I don't understand it. I, listen, you know I was always nice to you. I didn't quite understand it. I was always kind to you. You know I was kind to you, ma'am, sir. Police officer, I was always kind. Because again, it ain't about that stuff. I don't have to understand it. I just, I want what's right. I just want what's right for our veterans. And so do all these taxpayers. We demand it. Folks, keep coming by flicking me off. I love it. That's right. That's right, brother. That's right. That's right, brother. These demons. Folks, you don't scare me. If you run me over in the car, there's gonna be a hundred more of us out here. You, you understand some movement? That's right, man, you gotta look. <clears throat> Good grief, folks, this is outrageous. You know, for every one middle finger or demon eyes, I get about 30, uh, 30 hoorahs and honking horns, folks. Look, there's so many more of us than them, they're so weak. They got a spell on us, folks, we gotta get out of the spell. We gotta. We gotta put down the alcohol. Football season's over, folks. I told you, I don't even know who won. I don't care, because that demonic lady was doing the halftime show. And folks, we gotta, we can't, we can't let our friends watch that stuff. You better not be letting your children watch that. That lady's in a witchcraft, folks. Don't, don't test me, I know these things. Folks, go Google Taylor Swift and her, her concert last year. She did a, she did a witchcraft on all the, on the fans. And they don't even remember being there, folks. It's all true. Look at these demons. Look at these demons. What time is it? Folks, what time is it? It's about time for these demons to leave for the day. That's my favorite part. It makes everything so much worthwhile. That way we can we can do a public dress down of these demons. Folks, if I could get my hand... Well, I can't say that, folks. This is a joke. But listen, back in the day, they used to, fe they used to tar and feather these type of people. And you know, I understand why. Because when you get tar and feather on you, you can't just go take a shower. And it all it Folks, it takes months. Because we can't let these people get away with what they did to us. Look at these people. So you just gotta look at the uh, this guy looks like a restaurant right, friend. Folks, they got they got the they got the VA stickers on the car. Look at this guy right here. Stop harming our veterans, sir. Look at that lady there, you despicable lady. Good grief. That's right, friends, that's right. Told you, what's up with the ducks there? What's up with the ducks? Somebody come talk to me and explain to me what's up with the ducks. I don't know if it's bad or wrong. That guy seemed like a nice guy. So I, I folks, I could be wrong about the ducks. Somebody explain it to me. I don't understand these things, but listen, the demons that were foot, the, the demons with the purple hair and the, the lesbian stuff all over the Jeeps, well, they were really rude to me the other day. And folks, I'm certain that one of these demons were parked outside of Sergeant Crystal Grinch's fire base. Oh, you better not, folks. I'm just warning you. You don't want to mess around and find out. 
We're peaceful. Homeland security, good for the last time. We're peaceful. We just want peace. No violence. This isn't a trick. Look at that. Look at that man in that. Look at that man in that shuttle over there. That's the HEP shuttle, folks. Sergeant Grizzlegrist used to work in the homeless program. I know that 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 shuttle. It's going over to the HEP. Just down the street here off Seminole, folks. I used to pick up veterans there for goodness sakes. People don't know who you're messing with. I've been all over the place in the VA. I know all your dirty secrets. And I'm done doing your filthy, dirty laundry. Despicable. Great lady. Right. That's right, friends. You know what I'm talking about, true. Right, friends. You don't know what I know. Because, folks, these people are under the spell. It is, folks. To you, it's right, folks. You got to get their attention. You got you to help these people unplug. You, lady, we're not being harassing. We're just pointing. Look at that. Is that a duck, folks? What? What is up with the ducks, folks? I, I'm not making this stuff up. Somebody help! I'm about to lose my mind out here. That, that's a undercover cop, folks. Right there, he's doing. Folks, these people are everywhere. Listen, I know they're out here looking at me, and I don't care, folks. Video. I'm not doing nothing illegal. Listen, the more is this another jeep? Oh my goodness. Folks, I'm about to lose my mind with these damn Jeeps. Look at this guy. The woman. You know, it's hard to tell sometimes. That's right, friend. That's right. Listen, ladies, you gotta you gotta get back to looking like ladies. We, we can't be confused, alright? Just too many lies out there. Right. Oh, look at these people. Demons over here with grief. See, this is what a Jeep. That's a good Jeep, sir. We like that Jeep. See, that's what a Jeep's supposed to look like. You're not supposed to put a bunch of. Oh, look, folks, I don't understand these things, but listen, just somebody help me out. Look, there's another Jeep with all the stuff in it, folks. What is going on with this? That's a Jeep with a bunch of duckies, folks. Somebody help me. I'm about to lose my mind. Oh. Folks, I, I, I pray it's innocent, but listen, when these people. When they, when they play with little kitty toys and they, they trick us with the rainbow unicorns, it ain't good, folks. It's, it's perverted. And it involves children, I hate to tell you. It's a righteous man right here, buddy. I know. I know you. Stop harming our veterans. Bro, oh, these people are despicable. These people that work in here that harm our veterans. And the ones that are going along with the illegal orders. Listen, friends, you're going to go before Congress. I mean, you don't have a choice at this point. There's been too many, too much harm. Right here. People are weak. They're scared. Right here, lady. You gotta look. Folks, I don't want to be out here, but they didn't give me a choice. They, they, they removed me from my job illegally. Folks, I should be in there helping veterans right now, but I'm not. They put me out here. Folks, I didn't do this to myself. I didn't want to do this. Hey, lady, don't look away. You know, the ones that look away in shame, they're the ones that are that are doing the harm. That's right, friend. Hey, look, see? Folks, I got a gift. You gotta stop testing me. Those of y'all have known me for a long time. You knew something was different about me. You just couldn't figure it out. That's right, friend. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's a good man right there. That's right, sir. We're fed up, folks. We're just sick and tired of the line. Spokes better stuff. That's right. Oh. Hey. Hey, you right there, sir, right here. Oh. Folks, if you need a workout, come out here at Sergeant Grizzle Grits. This will get your blood pumping. I feel like I've done 10 PT tests in the last week, and I've scored a 300 on each one of them. Man, we're getting rid of the demons. They're harming us. Go to the website. Just go to the website. I got all the evidence. Hey. You right there. Folks, you gotta get their attention. You're not, we're not afraid anymore. We gotta get people's attention. Right, friend, that's right. We're not scared. We're gonna point at you, folks, that's right. Hey! Sir, you gotta get a helmet. Look, man, Sergeant Grizzle Grits. For those of y'all that knew me in the motorcycle world, I, I used to ride around with a Silly bandana on my head. Folks, you don't look cool when your brains are all over the road. Trust me. I, I lost too many good friends in those clubs. That's why we don't do it no more. 
That's right, friend. Hey, you. Talking to you, buddy, right there. Talking to you, sir. That's right, that's right. We're gonna let these demons know we're not afraid anymore. Oh, man. Here's the best part. Here's the best part, friends, when, they, when they're in that turn lane. Because we, we snuck up on them. They, they didn't know we were out here, so... Or they didn't check the email, because, you know, the perverted affairs, they're they're making this a big deal. They're saying there's a terrorist threat outside the... Go out the east gate. Folks, we're going to get some more people out here. We're going to be at both gates. It's a movement, folks. It just takes one... Well, listen, there's a whole army behind us. It ain't one guy, folks. It just ain't one guy. What if it was? It just takes one courageous folk to get out here. Folks, you got to go get a sign made. Go out in front of your VA. It don't take a lot of... Folks, it's all legal. This is our, this is public county property. Even though I don't pay taxes anymore, you guys do. And I'm so, so humble and grateful for that, friends. But we demand that we don't, we're not going to pay any more taxes to our homeless get housed. And then we'll, 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 we'll see what we got left for the illegals, folks. They didn't earn their right to be here. Oh, here's the best part, friends. Look at these people. Fucking you. Right, that's a good person. Look, the ones that flick us off. The ones that flick us off, we know they're the ones harmed. Look at this lady. Stop harming our veterans. Stop harming our veterans, lady. Look, I'm telling you folks, you got a gift. This is a, a righteous man there. You can tell the righteous folks. And you can tell the people that are harming our veterans, folks, these people are demonic. That's a good person right there. You can just tell they got flags on their car. This is a good man. That man served in Korea. Good gracious. Stop taking our fish oil away. I'm telling you, you demons, we got audits coming. Oh, buddy, you don't know. Because you see, I'm going to be the guy that's going to help the Trumpster put this thing back together. He needs a guy on the inside to, fig to figure out how all the, all the harm happened. Folks, we're going to demand resignations and we're doing audits. That's right, we're going to do an audit. Every GS-11 and higher that's been hired in the last three years under this nightmare administration. Folks, we're going to demand audits. It's so easy to demand an audit. We're going to look at the qualification. That's right, brother. It ain't about color. Friends, we're going to demand audits. We're going to make sure these people are qualified. And if they're not, they're going to be removed. Ma'am, it ain't about you over here in the voluntary service. I just pray that you're qualified, because if you're not, you're going back to Ohio. I'm sorry. We work too hard to make that place number one. We can't let you take it down, lady. Again, it ain't about you. You're a victim just like we all are. But if you ain't qualified, you're going back to Ohio, and you, you can take your perverted diversity chief with you. Yeah, he's going too, as soon as we, we get real leaders in here. That's right, friends. It ain't a threat. It ain't no threat. Everything's peaceful. But you know, you know something was off with that job interview. You probably didn't even have an interview, ma'am. They just said, look, we got a nice GS-12 for someone of your stature and color. Come on down to Florida. We're going to get you hooked up. Folks, we got to stop the madness. It ain't about race or color. It's about getting qualified people. Folks, this was the number one voluntary service. It's been that way for a long time. Look, I'm telling you, what's up with, the, what, what's up with that stuff, folks? Folks, what's up, with the, what's up with the duckies on the windshield? What's up with the duckies, friends? I'm about to lose my mind. They're out of here, friends. We got help on the way. Help's on the way. People are demonic. We're demanding resonations, friend, right here. Go to the website. Go to the website, my friends. Go to the website. That's right. That's right, buddy. Look at that. You're a good honorable man. That's right, sir. Oh, cigarettes are disgusting. Look, that's a Jeep and they don't have the perversion. That's a good man. Man, Friends, you got to stop the cigarettes. They're bad for you. I don't really trust the government, but even the Surgeon General says they're bad for you. Look at these demons, look at this demon right here. I told you, friends, look at these demons. They just want to come by and cause harm and problems. Folks, we're going to pray for these people. Because, listen, sir, sir, and that perverted Jeep that you're in, Cherokee, Lord Jesus, please let that man go to the website, sir. We got a righteous millstone just for him. Folks, it's people like that that are harming our children. They're going to go to the extra, they, they could just drive by and mind their business, but they got to have the little extra effort to show me their middle finger. Folks, it just shows the caliber of these people. They're weak. Because if they had an ounce of integrity, they'd come out here and confront me. And they're not doing it. They're not going to do that. They know better. That's why they drive by and flip all Sergeant Grizzle Grits off. Look, friends, that ain't gonna bother me. I've been a doormat for far too long. Goodness, I've been in combat, folks. I got more respect for those insurgents downrange. You know, when I really started thinking about it, we should have never been there. I got so much empathy for these people now because we were in their backyard. We shouldn't have been there. And again, I don't understand the Cooney Thursdays. It ain't for me to understand. I don't agree with it. Because I know it involves little children. Stop the harm, lady. Stop the harm. That's right, bro. That's right. Friends, we, the VA, the VA are not friendlies, folks. They become the enemy. I mean, I'm talking to everyone. I mean, there's a lot of good people, folks. But you know, when the lady gives you a hard time when you're checking in, that lady don't like you. And that lady don't, she don't want to help you. And that's why they give you a hard time. Folks, you gotta, don't, 
don't go to the patient advocate office, folks. You gotta call the congressman. Listen, the lady over here, Miss Whitaker, you're a bad lady. We're gonna get to you next, ma'am. You know, we had so many complaints in that office and you didn't do nothing about it. Miss Amy Whitaker, you're next on the list, lady. I'm sorry, you're a public official, you're doing harm. Folks, we did a complaint to her office and it was nothing to see. So ma'am, you're gonna go before Congress too. I hate to say it. Maybe they'll take your little your little service dog. Ma'am, I don't even know if you're a veteran. Why do you got that stupid picture of that dog in your office? Folks, these people are perverted. That's right, that's right. We're taking our VA back. That's right, that's right. That's right, that's right, that's right. See, out of every one middle finger, I get about 100 people that are righteous. Because listen, friends, there's more of us than these demons. That's right. Look at this guy, he almost ran into the bus. What is this guy doing here? What is this perverted? Hey sir, you're out of your jurisdiction. Hey, were you the one having sex in your squad car? Look at these people. What are they doing? Why are they following that bus? Sir, your jurisdiction left as soon as you left the property. Folks, I can't make this stuff up. That guy had some stuff in the windshield too, folks. Please, somebody explain it to me. I don't, I don't quite understand these things. And again, they're not for me to understand, but if you're gonna park one of these perverted Jeeps in front of my house, I need to know all the answers. Folks, that, that incompetent police officer almost rear-ended that bus. Folks, I'm not making this stuff up. This is real, it's a spiritual battle. The VA police got caught having sex in their squad car, friends. It might have been that guy, I don't know. I just know he didn't get fired. That's right, we got help on the way, ma'am. Help's on the way. Oh, these people are so despicable. Hey, we got the director to resign. We're going to work on the rest. That's right, ma'am. Help's on the way. Look, friends, we can't be as scared of these people. These people are weak. Friends, just a little bit of activism. We got one perverted pig to leave. And look, I'm sorry. We got to do those funny videos. And... Oh. God gave me a dark sense of humor, folks, and I'm trying to trying to help. Look at these look at these people. Oh, so much fun! To That's right. Help! Help! On my way. Look, you got these people that get their care here, and you got these demons. Stop harming our veterans! Look at these folks. Hey! That's right. That's right. Look, friends, we got to go join that American Legion. That's two geriatric people in there in their in their uniforms, folks. Goodness gracious! When I get some more people out of here, I'm heading straight over to Legion. I'm gonna renew my application, friends. And the VFW, sir, I've, it's been almost 20 years. How long's that been? Sir, it's been, it's been many years. Help's on the way. We gotta join these organizations. Help's on the way. Hey, what's up with the ducks? I don't understand it. Folks, what's up with the ducks? Somebody help me out. I don't, they look like righteous people and they had the ducks. I, I know I don't understand all these things, folks. Hey. Look at that lady, that lady's a demon. I just tell friends, I hate passing judgment. I ain't what I'm out here to do. We gotta call a spade a spade. When you're flicking me off and I'm out here trying to shed some light on some bad things that are happening to our veterans and children, and these people flick us off. Well, we know they're not on the winning team here. They're not righteous. Oh, because they don't want their perversions to end. They're just having too much fun with the lust and perverted stuff. Friends, we gotta stop this stuff. That's right. That's right, brother. Hey, go to the website. That's right, I'm talking to you. You right there. You from New York. Go back to New York, you pervert. Good grief. Folks, we got some good people from New York down here. Mr. Trumpster, I know you're from New York, but you had to leave that demonic place. Look at all these righteous women. Miss Grizzle Grits, you made a big mistake. Listen, friends. It's bad. What's going on?
people are so wicked. I'm talking to you, right? Hey, I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you, ma'am. You know, when you point at people, they gotta look at you. I'm looking right at you, sir. I'm glad you're paying attention to the road. Y'all shouldn't be looking at me. Folks, I should be at home playing Call of Duty and getting laundry done for Mrs. Griffo Grits. These people did something bad to me. That's right, sir. Talking to you, sir. Two hands on the steering wheel, lady. Good grief. What's wrong with y'all? Talking to you. Talking to you, ma'am. That's right. That's right. Folks, we're fed up. We're so fed up. We're peaceful people. That's why we're out here. You know, this goes against the whole narrative that people like us are violent and we're all, we should be on the terrace watch list. Folks, they just want to scare us and silence us. We're not scared anymore. We're just not scared. At least Sergeant Grizzly Grits is. I haven't been scared in a long time, folks. Folks, if I was scared, I would have quit. I would have resigned. I would have just gone off and killed myself. But I'm not. Because that'll lead you straight to hell. We don't want to go there, folks. I've seen this, this place is hell, folks. Hell ain't always just a big fiery furnace you go. This is hell. What they're doing over here is hell. The perverted pajama parties is hell. Look, look at more of these people. That's right, friends. That's right. That's right, brother. Look at these perverted people right here. That's right, friend. That's right. Righteousness. That's right, lady. Look at this guy right here. Oh, these people. People make me sick. That's right, friends. That's right. Stop harming our veterans, lady. Stop harming our veterans. People are sick, sir. They're sick. One of them right there. These people are so despicable. Folks, I used to work with these people. I know these people. I was the assistant chief and then the acting chief. Folks, I interacted with every service in this hospital. Everyone in here knows who I am. They know my real name. They know what I did. But see, they've been lied to. They told them that I was AWOL and I'm crazy and I hate gay people. Folks, this is how bad these people are. None of that's true. And those of y'all know me know that. These people lie. They, they see, they chill. Look at this lady. Good grief, folks. What's wrong with y'all? Friends, if I was crazy, they, well, they've already tried to lock me up. They can't do that. they got to stop the harassment, and they have. Folks, this is where it gets scary, because this is where this is where these folks call for backup, and I ain't talking about the local county, folks. If you don't hear from me for a little while, that's right, brother, help on the way. Friends, if I disappear, call the local, call, call Byron Donald's office. They'll know right where to go find me, friends. People are going to lock me up for telling you all the truth. Look, oh, there's another Jeep. What did I tell you, friends? It's the same perverted Jeep. Told you someone's going to try to run me over today. Look at these people. Look at this guy right here. What's up with the Jeeps? What's up with the Jeeps? All right, he's a friendly. Hey, buddy, I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you. Don't look away, ma'am. You need to look. It's a little sparkly steering wheel she had, but that's okay. We can all be different, friends. I don't have to understand these things. Of these people. If we just had a handful more people out of here, they'd be gone a lot quicker. Ugh. Get a bite to eat. Oh, I, I got plenty of. Hey, thank you, brother. I got plenty of water, ma'am. We're prepared out here. So you got to go to your appointment, huh? Yeah. Good luck in there, ma'am. We're gonna be praying for you. These people are wicked in there. If they give you a hard time, ma'am, come back out here and talk to me. We'll get you in contact with the Congress people. Folks, we can't trust these. We can't. We don't trust the VA anymore, folks. They lied on Sergeant Grizzle Grits. They lied so many times, and they're caught. Friends, we got eight charges, uh, folks. They're, we're suing these people. We didn't go to the website. We're suing them. This ain't make believe stuff. It's all real. Oh, 
Sergeant Grizzle Grizzle. That's my right character. Right. There he is. Okay. I, I'm trying to keep my identity. I, I, these people are crazy. Man. I, know, like, I had to come I up with a little I know. I know. I mean, these I people know. You on X. That's right. There you go, man. Oh, God. These are some righteous people, folks. We got to stop the madness. What? Look at these people. Stop harming our veterans, ma'am. I know you're doing it. Oh, I can't tell. Sometimes you just don't know. You don't want to pass judgment, friends. But then there's just sometimes you just, you just, they, they flip you off. You just know. You can just look at them in the face. Ma'am, did you hit the button over there? It, it takes a minute. Folks, I've called all the news people. They don't want to cover this because they're covering it up, folks. That's why they put the little puff piece that this demonic Paul Russo, he's going to resign because he, he, he got a little bad rating. Folks, it ain't that. He's invested. Congress is looking into this guy. Whew. Right, friend, right here. You. Talking to you, buddy. Oh, man. Two hands on that steering wheel, ma'am. You can blow your nose later. Good grief, these people are so dangerous. stuff in it folks I don't I don't understand these things somebody help Sergeant Grizzle Grits that's right Fred look Sergeant Grizzle we should be out on our boat fishing hey hey talking to you And the lady said, I hate you. See, Sergeant Grizzlegrits has the gift of reading reading lips. That lady said, I hate you. Ma'am, you hate you hate God. That's why you're being demonic. I'm gonna pray for you, ma'am. You're gonna lose your job. That's right, brother. That's right. Don't stop, I, don't stop doubting me. These people are bad. They're bad and they don't like us. They don't like veterans. And the ones that are giving us the, fi the finger and the, and the mouth and the potty words at us. Folks, they don't like us. They all work in here and they're doing harm to us. Folks, they don't like us. We need to go get them a job, maybe. Well, they don't need to have a job in the in the federal government, folks. They need to go get a real job. That way they can know what a real day's work's like. Folks, these people, they, they abuse their lunch hour. Folks, you get 30 minutes. If you're if you're over 15 out of that 30, if you take 45, you gotta put in 15 minutes, folks. That's how the rules are supposed to work. But they don't, not here. These people use and abuse and they don't like us. Right, sir, that's right. That's right. Let's see. Let's see if we can find a demon. That looks like a demon right there. Uh, I don't know, maybe. That's. I don't know, folks. What time is it? Oh, uh, we'll get all the demons when they're getting ready to leave. That's right. That's right. That's a good one there, friend. God, you good brother. Hey! Look at that, that's some righteous machinery. It's gonna go. Look, ladies, you can't drive that stuff. I'm sorry. A man's gotta get on that machine and make it work. Two! Stop, stop testing me. Look, we got the perverted police officers. Oh, they got their perverted lieutenant out there. Maybe somebody can let us know who that pervert was that had the sex in the car. Folks, I'm not making this stuff up. Look at these demons over there. He's gotta hide over there. These people are perverted. Oh, good Lord Jesus. They got nothing better to do to sit over there and. Call the Homeland Security on certain results. Folks, we cannot fear these people. We can't fear them anymore. We're going to demand audits of all these. Look at them videotaping me. Hey, I'm over here. Folks, we're going to demand audits of all these all these senior leaders. They ain't working for us anymore. Hey. I'm talking to you. 
contract, sir. Hey! Talking to you, sir, that's right. Hey, that's right, sir, that's right. We'll take back our BA. That's right. Talking to you. No. That's right, sir. That's right. Talking to you right here, buddy. That's right. It's a righteous lady. Oh, she had a nice steering wheel, too. All kind of bling bling on it. That's right, sir. Look at these demons driving these cars. The guy was flipping me off, friends. Look, I, don't bother me. You can flip me off. You can hate me all you want. They ain't gonna, they ain't gonna deter Sergeant Grizzle Grits. Sir, get off your phone. You're gonna get a ticket. Hey, I'm talking to you. There's more, there's a Jeep with more of the weird stuff, folks. Somebody help me out here, friend. I don't know these things. Look at these perverted places. I'm talking to you over there. Stop harming our veterans. Put down the snacks, sir. You need to put both hands on the wheel. Good grief, folks. I can't, I can't be everywhere at once. Just one hum, humble soldier trying to fix the VA. Good grief. You gotta put both hands on the steering wheel. Y'all know how bad the drivers are down here, folks? Look, we're, we're in Bay Pines. This is, there's accidents. I'm surprised I haven't been run over yet, folks. And listen, you, you demons, don't just try to run me over. God's got me protected out here. We say a prayer every time we come out. Good Lord Jesus, please protect us. Protect us from these demons. That's right, friend. That's right. That man came over here on his lunch break to get his blood drawn. That's right, friend. We're going to fix the VA. That's right, brother. Look at that guy. He's got a helmet on. See, friends, you can still look cool on the bike with a helmet. And trust me, your head's going to thank you when you, if you ever got to take that little spill. Folks, we knew too many good men that died on the bikes. That's right, friend. We got Paul Russo to resign. We're going to work on the rest. <coughs> look at that, sir. What is that? I don't understand it. People, people, why do we got ducks in the winch? I just don't know. It's, oh, dude, I'll never know. But I'm going to tell you all something. Y'all better stop parking in front of the fire base. It ain't going to work out good for you. It just won't work out good for you. Oh, these people are so rotten. Hey, that's right, brother. Hey! Listen, friends, I'm sorry I'm yelling at people. It's my First Amendment, right? I served, I put my ass on the line down there. We're gonna... That's right, friends. Friends, I'm not harassing anyone, and everyone's just a little too sensitive nowadays. We gotta get out here and let people know we're not playing around. Don't just sneak up on me, I see ya. That's why we're out here in the public. That's right, friends. Help's on the way. We're gonna get rid of these demons. I'm talking to you two ladies. That's right. I'm talking to you, sir. Right here, buddy. That's right, friend. Folks, we gotta we gotta wake these people up. We're in a stupor. I'm talking to you, friend. Hey, right here. Hey. I'm talking to you. That's right. School bus driver. I'm talking to you. Oh, good thing I wasn't six six six. It was a six six six. My friends. You may have to report them. Oh, here's an, here's an out-of-stater. They're definitely not friendly, folks. You just gotta, you gotta have a gift. Listen, you liberals, y'all gotta, gotta get with the program, y'all. <laughs> Friends, I hate to say it, I don't know one liberal person who's a good Christian. I just don't know one. Name me one person that follows those liberal policies that's a good, good Christian. Just name one person, I, I, I'll wait. Folks, it's not about politics, it's about right and wrong. These people want to push all this perversion on our children. And they want to make us, they want, they want to throw us in jail for standing in the way. Folks, folks, the Bible talks about standing in the gap in the wall. Folks, that's what we're doing out here. Folks, there's another Jeep with all this stuff. Folks, I don't understand these things. Oh, I would go ask them, but I don't want to get shot. What's wrong with these people? Hey! Right, sir, that's right. You know it's right too, buddy. Put down that big pen, put both wheels on that steering wheel. Jesus demands it. That's right, buddy. Sorry, that was a lady. Ma'am, I'm so sorry. You had, you had some men's shades on. Go, friends, get a little windy. Hey! So, what's... All right, he's a friendly... Folks, it must... Folks, it must be... It must be a non-issue. Folks, I'm so sorry I brought it up. 
It's just one of these demons are outside of our house yesterday, and, and I think they had the perverted stuff in there. I just don't understand these things. What do you think, folks? Y'all need to go ahead and get off this transmission. Go call your Congress, folks. Demand action. Look, they're waiting for y'all to call. We were, hey, what's up, sir? Right here. Ugh. It's me. Come over here and talk to me. I'm friendly. I used to work here. I still work here. Sir, I, I still work here. They just, they're scared. They don't know what I'm doing out here, friends. That's why you gotta go to the website. Go to the website, friends. We got Miss Justina Wells. Oh, you didn't think we'd ever find out, did you, lady? Folks, this lady rated Sergeant Grizzle Grits a 0, 0.0 on performance-based interview questions. There were seven questions. Two out of the seven, she gave me a 0, 0.0. Friends, the score was a one through five. And trust me, she gave me some ones. This lady did it because she was trying to prove to the perverted lizard people that she was she wanted to dance pervertedly naked up there with a demonic pentad. She was letting them know that she's down with the DEI cause. But listen, lady, you, you underestimated Sergeant Grizzle Grits. We got that for you. And listen, lady, we're going after a lot more stuff. These people are arrogant. They don't realize that every single thing that they do, listen, friends, every email, every... Every con when they had mold in that kitchen, there's a contract, folks. Surf Pro was the company. Just ask for a FOIA request. Surf Pro was the folks. They had the Surf Pro trailer parked in the back for a month. They had to clean up Miss Florida. Yes, it's Miss Florida. Miss Michelle Florida, the chief. She's a diversity hire, friends. Trust me. That's why they had mold. And that's why Mr. Turner covered it up, sir. You're gone, too. Because Mr. Turner... Mr. Turner's in charge of the canteen. He's also in charge of the police. So he's he's responsible for the police having sex in the cars. Mr. Turner, you gotta go. We, you don't got a choice, buddy. That's right, that's right. Folks, these people don't like us. They've been feeding us moldy food. Folks, it wasn't just mold. They had rats and roaches. Folks, why do you think they had to hire a company to come out there and clean the kitchen? Good grief. These people need to resign immediately, folks. We allow this to go on. Look at these people. Get that thing in the shop, brother. It don't sound good. That's right. You got to look. Folks, these people are weak. That's why they got to lie. That's why they got to hide their identity, you know. We're not, we're not afraid anymore. We're just not. We're combat veterans. Good grief. We've been in combat. We're not afraid. Good grief. We weren't afraid then because we were highly trained and you know that adrenaline kicked in. The training kicked in, folks. God's been training Sergeant Girls of Grits for years for the spiritual battle. That's why we're not afraid. That's why we're out here in their face. Peacefully, peacefully, friends. Look at this. I know we're going to get a demon. This lady right here. Hey, stop harming our veterans. These people think they're going to scurry away early on a Friday. Right, that's right. It ain't about color. See, these ladies work in the kitchen, folks. They know there's mold because they didn't clean it because Miss Florida told them they didn't have to because they want moldy food served to us. Stop harming our veterans. I know you're doing it. Look, friends, we got to stop the madness. Oh, geez, what does this guy want? What's going on, brother? It's a little slow. You getting care over here? Yes, sir. Hey, brother, listen. I used to work here. Here's my business card. Thank you. I was the assistant chief of voluntary service. They, they illegally removed me because I'm a white guy. Because they're pushing the diversity, equity, and inclusion. That's right. I'm the whistleblower. I'm working with Congress right now. Okay. Will you do me a favor? Yeah. Go infiltrate that place. Just go, go pass get... Pass them out. Go pass them out, friends. I got you, brother. Listen, I just got the director, Paul Russo, resigned. When you go up there, go to the front desk and say, I demand... I demand... Justina Wells resigned for what she did to the guy outside, folks. Pass the cards out. All those volunteers at the front, I, those were my employees, my friend. Yeah. Oh, these people are so horrible. 
Listen, brother, are you spiritual? Yeah. Can I pray for you? Dear Lord Jesus, we're going to pray for this man. We're going to pray the demons release their grip on this place, Lord. He's a good man right here. We pray you protect him when he goes in there. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Go for Thank it, my you, brother. brother. Find me on that website. Yes, Listen, friends, every every veteran I've met out here in the last three days, we say a prayer. And we're getting these demons to resign. Oh. Sir, don't let, them t don't let them give you any vaccinations. They're trying to kill us. Go to the website. Hey, you. Look at the VA police, friends. They're, they're hiding. They're hiding. It's right, friend. Look, friend, we're smart here. We know, they're, we, know, we know they're in the parking lot back here looking at us and videotaping us. Because Homeland Security, they just need they, they, they just need something to come down here and harass us, and they don't have enough yet because we haven't done nothing wrong. But folks, they're going to make something up just like they did the AIB. So horrible what they did to my family. Friends, I don't care about me. I like suffering. That's why I'm out here in the sun. But my family don't need to go through this nonsense. We demand res resignations. These people are not going to get retirement. That's out of the question. He didn't give me retirement. He sent me right. He sent me home. That's right, friend. That's an outstanding car. That's a, that's a veteran there. See, Sergeant Bristlegrits wants to go buy that Corvette. But I can't do it right now. I got more work to do. Hey! Oh, look at this perverted piece. Look at this perverted piece. I see you right there. Folks, let's go down here and take a look at these perverts. Oh, these people are so rotten. Folks, we're gonna we're gonna go down here where the police have perched. Because they, they don't want to get too close to Sergeant Grizzle Grits, oh they don't. Because they're scared. Oh Lord Jesus, they're scared of they're scared of excellence. Look at these folks. Oh geez, am I gonna get a ticket for crossing the street? Oh Lord, I probably will. Look, friends, we're just gonna go down here. Look at this guy. Look at these people, man. This isn't harassment. We pay these people salaries. They need to be over there at the hospital making sure. Making sure a veteran ain't, or making sure an employee ain't doing disruptive behaviors like that horrible lady I had. Folks, see how many times I called the police on that lady? And they didn't do anything about her. The police were, had their hands tied. Oh. Look at this guy. Look at this guy over here. I'm not afraid of y'all. Who do you think you are? Oh, that's right, they scurried. Look at they scurried away. Look at them scurrying away right there. Look at them, look at them right there. I'm looking right at you. Look at these, these people are despicable. Now he just moved his car. He just parked his car like he just parked there for his lunch break. That's right, friends. People are despicable. You. See that, folks? That's intimidating. Well, they, they don't intimidate me. They had a little meeting with the chief. Over there. They had a little meeting with the chief in the unmarked car, and then they told the the, the, the VA police officer to, to keep to keep a distance, but keep eyes on me. Folks, I'm not a threat. I'm just exposing the lies. And look, he 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 moved. Look, he's moving. There he goes, folks. There they go. They got to go back and have sex in the cemetery, folks. It's time to go do some perverted stuff. Look at these people. Folks, that's your tax. People. Folks, we got people starving out there. Folks, I don't have to explain this to you. Look at this guy. Look, we just we just made him leave. They just scurried away. We don't, we're not intimidated, people. Leave us alone. Look at him. Folks, it just takes a little bit of a little, a little bit of courage. You see him scurrying away. Look at him scurry away. Folks, they don't want to mess with right. They know I'm working with Congress and they know not to mess. Now they're just acting like it, no big deal. Folks, we're done, we're done with the games. We're just done with the games. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna FOIA requests. We're gonna have so many FOIA requests going in that place. Oh, miss. 
whatever your name is in the FOIA office. Folks, Miss Brown runs the FOIA office. That's why she redacted everything. Listen, that's why she's got to go. When you ask for a FOIA request, you're, you, you need the information. Those people want to redact everything. But they can't redact everything. We got enough evidence. That's why they got eight charges and they got more coming. All these people are so despicable. Afraid of these people. Good grief, man. Go back and have sex in the cemetery in your squad car. Leave me alone. <laughs> right, friends, come out here with me. It's horrible is going on. Sorry, friends, we had to we had to chase off the perverted police. We don't need them out here. And if they need to go back and secure the facility, they need to go make sure that horrible lady, Mrs. Perfect. Folks, just go to the website. She's a public official. It ain't personal. But she's done so much harm here. You got to know who this lady is. And you got to demand she'd be fired. Listen, don't let that lady get any kind of... Friends, don't, don't let that lady get any kind of retirement. That lady's caused so much harm to our volunteers. This lady's harm older, older geriatric people. That's right, brother. Hey. Great. Folks, look. The cops are gone. We screwed them away. Those are some nice shades, lady. Again, I don't understand them, but I don't have to, folks. Oh, these people are so rotten. Oh, good grief. Cops, man. Oh, fucking... oh, Lord Jesus, I didn't mean to say the curse word at all. Lord Jesus. Forgive me for that. Oh. I don't know how much more of this I can stand, folks. It's madness. Friends, that's a Jeep with a Patriot in it. He ain't got no duckies. I, I, I just don't understand these ladies. Help me. Help me, friends. That's right, brother. That's right. That's right. Go to the website. Oh, there goes another demon. Lady just whipped me off in the car. Folks, I can't pick this stuff up. These people hate us. Good Lord have mercy. That's right, brother. Don't look confused, sir. You know they're not treating us well. They took our fish oil away and they're giving it to the tangos. Folks, don't take my word for it. The VA secretary was saying it earlier in the week. Another Jeep with duckies. Friends, help me, please. I'm about to lose my mind. Not really, friends. I'm completely fine. So, friends, that's what a Jeep's supposed to look like in Sergeant Grizzle. It's got the camo. It's ready to go out in the woods, folks. They ain't got no silly ducks in it. Listen, you perverted, you perverted affairs guy. I know you're watching. Buddy, we're gonna get to you last. Like I told you, we're gonna peel the onion layer. We're, we're saving the best for last, because you're you're absolutely the worst person that we've ever known in our life. Not only do you like the you, not only do you get pleasure out of harming all the people here, you go around and spread lies about Sergeant Grizzle Grits. You tell him I hate the gays. Folks, no, that ain't true. I just don't like this guy because he likes to harm people. Friend, we're not making accusations, but listen. I know for a fact. I know for a fact you don't like families, and I know a fact you don't like children, and if you had a chance to harm one of them, I know you would. Folks, that's not an accusation. I just know this demonic man. Look, look friends, what I tell you, that's the Jeep people right there. They're the ones that have been harassing me. Look at these folks. They work here. They're coming back from their lunch break. I see you. 
I see you. I know who you are. I see you. Look at him. Look at him videotaping me, friends. I told you there's something. Look. We, we know who you are, buddy. Friends, I told you they're not friendly. There's something with these people. It's a club, and they don't like me because they think I hate the gays, and I don't. I think what it's about, people. Friends, look, look at this person over here. Friends, they're the ones flicking me off. Not all of them, but a lot of the folks in these little Jeep clubs. What does that say? Off-road, off-road buggy. Friends, help me out. I need some help. I'm going to get home and do a little research tonight, but they ain't friendly because they're flicking me off. And they're whatever. You in the domiciliary, sir? You need to get out of there. We'll get you to Tampa. Right, so that's me. That's me. <laughs> Talking to you. That's right, friend. We got him go. Grief, friend. What time is it getting to be? Let me see here. Oh. The best part of the day. This is when all the demons flee the ship. Lady here. Stop harming our veterans. Right, brother's right. People are so rotten. It's right, brother. Stop harming our veterans, lady. Folks, you can just tell they got the shirts on. They got the shirts. They got this guy's got the badge on, folks. Folks, if they're in there and they're not a whistleblower, they're a part of the problem. I hate to say it. Because you got a whistleblow, folks. You're following illegal orders and you're gonna lose your job. Trust me, there's so many righteous veterans like myself that are unemployed. We can't wait to get back in there. And trust me, the Trumpster's gonna make it happen. We need real leaders in there. We need people that are going to come out here and demand action like Sergeant Grizzle Grits. Oh, Lord Jesus, don't let me use the profanity, Lord. I don't want to do that. That's a part of Sergeant Grizzle Grits' past. I'm just getting so worked up, folks. Don't come find Sergeant Grizzle Grits, people. It won't work out good for you. Ugh. These people make me so disgusted. Ugh. You.
little show despicable. Show this, not you lady, we don't know who you are, but these people in here are just gonna Trent, brother. Hey! Look these people over here, look at these people. Folks, this is, this, I'm not supposed to get any joy out of this, but look, Lord, forgive me. I do get a little pleasure dressing down the demonic staff that work here that are following illegal orders. Y'all gotta stop it, folks, you're gonna lose your jobs. Oh, good grief. I know there's a there's a, another homeless veteran out here earlier and see this is why I, I buy three cheeseburgers on the way out here I only eat two but I got one in case I need one later but I gave this man a meal you know good grief these people they're having perverted pajama parties up here hey I'm not really sure if that was a lady or not right, brother look we don't have to understand these things folks just stop harming our veterans good grief Stop the nonsense. We don't ask for a lot. Stop, stop taking away from us and giving it to all the tangos. Look, we don't understand those things, but you got to cease and desist. Good grief. We wouldn't do this to y'all. We didn't do this to y'all when Trump was in there. Actually, y'all remember the VA Accountability Act? Go look it up, friends. The union here, the union, they worked to get rid of it. Folks, they, they went back and they hired all the bad employees. Folks, if we had that a bit Accountability Act, all these people would have been gone last year when I reported them. But we can't do that now. We gotta get rid of the good people like Sergeant Grizzle Grits. Folks, this is despicable. We won't stand for it no more, sir. We won't stand for it. That's why we're out here staying and out here. Oh, good grief. Look at this lady here. These people, they, they, they go down here, they take a U-turn, they come back to the light to get a look at Sergeant Grizzle Grits. Folks, I'm not kidding you. They're not getting any leadership out of this demonic pen tab. So they gotta come out here and see for themselves what it looks like. And it makes them nervous, friends, because they know what's coming. They know we're going to get some competent people in here. Folks, we all saw that old demented man with the poopy diapers on last night. Folks, oh goodness, oh look, here's our friend again. Look, here's our friend. Right. Look at the people in the Jeep. What's, what's up with the people in the Jeeps? Why do y'all got to hate on Sergeant Grizzle Grits? I'm just trying to help us. Oh, good morning. Talking to you. Right here, buddy, right here. Sir. Talking to you, ma'am. Two hands on that steering wheel, lady. What's wrong with you? Good grief, lady. Y'all know where we are. Gosh, that's why, listen, folks, that's why our insurance has gone up. Sergeant Grizzle Grits hasn't had an accident or a ticket in like 20 years, and every year my insurance goes up. And I called him and I said, What the heck's going on here? And they said, Well, all the. All the bad drivers made it go up, sir, because nobody wants to pay their premiums. You're 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 the good white guy that, that follows the rules, so we're just gonna keep punishing you. Folks, we gotta demand action. You, talking to you, buddy, right there. With a little work, sir, that beard will look righteous, but right now you look silly. Folks, we gotta learn to be men again. We gotta stop listening to women. And, m m women it ain't a sexist thing, just go to the website. It's not right lady. Right, look, God made us different for a reason. If God wanted us all the same, he'd make us all tangos, but he didn't. And again, I, I, we don't understand that. And it, it, it ain't wrong, friends. We love y'all. Stop being manipulated. I didn't like the SSRIs they were pumping in me. And I, I, we, we prayed hard and we took ourselves off. And folks, listen. There was no side effects. The only thing was Sergeant Grizzle Grits was able to maintain an erection. Folks, those things are designed to, to make you not work properly. You know these things. That's why you can't get it up. Folks, they want to destroy us. They want us... Folks, when you can't get the goods up, Mama Grizzle Grits, well, she gets... She loses interest. You got to get off those things. Folks, there's healthy ways to do it. I'm not giving out... I'm not giving out... Don't don't go against your doctor's orders, but listen, folks. I'm telling you, these people in here, are, they don't got our best interests at heart. Go, Hey, listen, folks, go to the community care. We got a thing called Choice Program. Splendid. Folks, use the choice program. Go out in the community. Demand that we get to go out in the community. If we stop using care here, folks, if we stop coming here, the money stops flowing, and then these demons lose their jobs. That's true. Folks, why do you think I was in a congressional office for almost two years? Stop doubting me, folks. I know, I know these things. You know, Congress, they don't have all the answers. That's why they needed a guy on the inside. 
But listen, friends, that's why they're letting me do my work down here. We're just we're keeping our safe distance. Look, there's more of the weird stuff. Somebody's got to explain that to me. I, I, I get some. I get some good honks out of these folks, and I get a lot of middle fingers. Folks, I gotta let you know, we started the website like three weeks ago, and we only had a handful of folks. You gotta go to the website, all the information's there. Folks, we, we've almost got 3,000 people checking it out in the last two days. Right, bro, that's a good process, man. Fucking you with a bounty toilet, the toilet in the back. That's right, lady. All those righteous people. That, listen, that lady was demonic. She had a demonic necklace. Look, if you got the necklaces around your neck, and it has a little, it's got a little lock on it, folks. That's a, that's a bondage thing. It's sex, folks. It means that you belong to someone, and they do perverted things to you, folks. Don't, don't test me. I know these things, folks. You gotta. Go get yourself some bolt cutters and cut the demonic locks off your neck. You don't belong to nobody. God gave you, God gave you free will for a reason. That's why the devil wants to trick you. And look, for all the friends that are in here doing the demonic stuff, you gotta cease and desist. Look, we've been praying hard. We're gonna continue to pray. This is a righteous place. This place is, look at that, C.W. Bill Young. Sir, I know you're looking down from heaven at us and you're happy we're down here. I'm sorry your, your widow's confused, but we're gonna get a righteous, sir. We don't have much time, and I know I know y'all want to be reunited. She's been hanging around the perverts too long. She should not feel sorry. Well, we should all feel sorry for this demonic man, Mr. Russo. But he's weak and he's a pervert. He's gone. Folks, here's the best part of the day. Oh, we're humble. We don't like taking pleasure in this, but look. That's the, not all of them. Those are some righteous people. But this is when the demons come out. And they like to come out here because they like to look at me. They don't they don't scurry out the back gate like the leadership. Oh, there ain't no leadership, folks. The people occupying the, the lizard people. Folks. We get to look them in the face. We're not afraid of you. Oh, buddy. Look at this man. Sir, you're going to get run over. Oh, Lord Jesus. I don't... I don't good Lord. Oh, look, look, friends. This is why we got our trauma kit with us. This man just walked out in traffic with his little doggy. Oh, good Lord. Oh, look at this man. Folks, do you see that bicycle right there? I, I got that man that bike last year in voluntary service. Goodness gracious. Hey, sir, I got you that bike. You don't understand what these people have done. I, you just can't erase me from this place. That man on that green bike. My GS11, him and I, he's the one that bought it, but we put it together. Couldn't tell people are so demonic. You just want me to go kill myself. You're not going to erase me. You should be ashamed of yourself. Driving around in a BMW and we got homeless people out here. Friends, listen, I don't I don't hate on people who are successful. As long as these people got pajama parties in there, we're gonna put the heat on them. Everyone in there. These people gotta start coming forward. You gotta start coming forward, folks. Congress just needs a little more. Well, they got enough evidence. Folks, the, the, the more y'all come out, the quicker this madness ends. Then we get another pervert in there, then we just keep the heat on them until Trumpster gets in there. Then everybody's getting fired, we know that what happens in these administrations they don't we're gonna get rid of all of them because like trumpsters like old sergeant grizzle grits he's been he's been done bad by too many people that's why loyalty friends you gotta have loyalty listen sergeant grizzle grits may go to big places once this is clipped and this mess is cleaned up but we gotta clean this mess up first we don't got a choice in the matter than this person more demonic stuff in the windshield oh lord jesus Folks, when you got the gift, oh Lord, sometimes I wish I didn't, I don't want to say that, Jesus, I can't, I can't ask these questions. <sighs> Friends, I told my kids this, when you see something, you can never unsee it. That's why we got to make sure our children stay as innocent as long as they can. We can't let them see things that their mind, we don't want them getting perverted. Friends, I've seen the demons in here, I, I can't, God made me look at them, I can't look away any further, I can't. I can't keep all this information to myself anymore. And folks, we know people are already coming forward. They're already confirming all the stuff I'm telling you in here. Besides that, we got the evidence on the website. Oh. These people are so despicable.
leading a great. You. Right. Folks, it's not about color again. It ain't about no L, no G, no Tango. It's about veterans. Goodness gracious. You gotta trust me. I love everyone. I just I, some things I don't understand, and I don't. I don't have two friends. I don't have to understand it. Just don't don't keep taking from me. And folks, you gotta leave the children. I'm, listen, this is your final warning. God ain't gonna be kind to y'all, folks. Trust me. That's right, ma'am. Go to the website. All your wildest dreams will come true there. You'll find out what these demons are doing. That's right, friend. That's right. That's right. We're sick and tired of this, folks. These people know this place is bad. They just they don't know what to do. Folks, look. We got to get some skin in the game. I'm talking to my Iraq Afghanistan veterans. Some of y'all are still able-bodied. Listen, don't let these people tell you you got to stay home 100%. Don't do anything that's going to cause you harm. But look, if you can come out here and drink a little water and yell at people out, if you can come out here and stand and hold a flag up, you can come out here and stay on certain years of grits. Trust me, you'll feel better you did. It's a movement, folks. We're going to get rid of these people. We don't have a choice. They've been in there too long. Let's see how many... Oh, here we go. There's a good man. There's a good man right there. That's right. There's another good man. That's right. That's right. Just let's see. I know we got a demon somewhere. Where's the demon? Oh, that's a... Uh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, these people are so perverted. Stop harming our veterans, lady. Look, y'all got to stop following these illegal orders. Y'all may be good people. You got to stop with the harm. Look, there's more ducks, folks. I don't I don't understand the ducks. Somebody help me out. Oh, good Lord. Look, friends, we got little rubber duckies in my kid's bathtub. That's about all I understand about these things. I know they involve children, and I don't, I don't, I don't think they belong in people's cars. That's right. Go to the website. Hey, you. Nice glasses. I like them. Look, friends, these people are so horrible. Don't take my word for it. Just go to the website. I'm still an employee in this place, folks. I didn't bring my PIF card out here because it's in the laptop that we gave Congress. All these people are in so much hot water. Oh, that lady, Miss Brown, she demanded I turn in that laptop. Folks, she's demanded me in a letter that I come back to work and face discipline or I need to resign. And she said, listen, folks, this is why I think she's a lizard lady. She said, as a human and as a veteran, I hope you have a good life. Folks, only a lizard person would wish a human that. Oh, goodness gracious. I hope this lady ain't causing no problems. Oh, she's bringing a little water. Oh, you're a righteous lady, ma'am. Oh, you're so wonderful. <laughs> well, I brought some water, but I need it. Thank you. Are you a better? Oh, you definitely are. Oh, my grandfather. Listen, ma'am, I work here. I, I'm still an employee here. They got rid of me for being a white guy. Oh, They're cute. pushing the D and I. Let me give you a business card. We just got our card. Oh, I think I gave him out. You go to the website. I'm suing them for eight charges. I just got the director to resign. I'm going after the rest. Heck yeah. They're not your grandfather? No, he never went there, but yeah. Oh, these people, the police got caught having sex in their squad car last September. It's all on my website. The news did it. Okay. These people are despicable, ma'am. I had the VA police. They called the sheriff's on me the other day. I'm coming out here every day that these people are gone. Well, thank you for telling us. Thank you for telling us. The news don't even want to cover it. I called all the not. news. They, they said they hung up on me. They won't touch it. Call wow. the alternative people. Call them wow. Info Wars, Alex yeah. Jones, all those guys. I can't get through. I'm out here. Something grits. Sergeant Grizzle Sergeant Grits. Sergeant Grizzle Grits. My character. I got, I got, I'm a real guy. I got a family. Got you. These demons are flipping me. I had a guy almost throw something at me over here. Wow. It's a spiritual battle, ma'am. Instead of bringing you fucking water. What the hell? Are you a Christian? I am. Can I pray with you? I, I know. You gotta start praying in public. I got one okay. demon to resign. Okay, yep. real quick. Yep, let's do it. Lord Jesus, we command the demons release their grip on this place. This place is named after a righteous congressman right there, ma'am. C.W. Bill Young. We demand the demons release their grip. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. I, I, someone taught me to pray in public, and guess what? I got a demon to resign. That's right. Tell your grand, grandfather, right? Hey, yeah, yeah. He's passed on now. That's why I got he, it he's here. He's down there looking on us. Yep. This flag was on my brother-in-law's casket. He died in, in Baghdad. So sorry, He's out here with us. It's a spiritual battle, man. Pray for us. Go to the website. Yep. Go look it up right now. You're not going to be disappointed. And listen, I don't hate the gays. These people are telling them that I hate the gays. I just want men to be men again. Hey. Don't, don't you need a good, strong man in your life? I got you. Yeah, we, men don't even know how to change tires anymore. Go to my website. We're going to do a class on it. That's right. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you for your grandfather. Look, friends. Friends, this is a nice ice cold bottle of water. A good lady brought me. Folks, these people are sick and tired of it. That lady's grandfather was an honorable veteran. But he was he was blessed that he didn't get his care here. These people are so rotten. Look at that demon right there. Yeah, I'm talking to you. 
Folks, you can't hide from Sergeant Grizzle Grits. I just, I just know too much. I know too much. Oh Lord, hey friends, friends, you already know what we gotta do. Lord Jesus, we, we pray for whoever they're going to take that veteran. That veteran's going to folks. They, they can't. They couldn't help the veteran here at the, the ED because they're incompetent. So they're taking them. Whoever that veteran is, he's going to a higher level of care at a real facility. Lord, we, we pray that the first responders get there safely. Lord, we again we pray that the, the demons release folks. An ambulance shouldn't be leaving the VA with a veteran in it. It's despicable. It's not an emergency department. It's a perverted department. Folks, don't take my word for it. God ain't gonna give you a second chance when you take that spill. You're gonna have your brains all over the road. Oh Lord, oh God, Lord. Oh, the demons for it. I, I just felt weakness. Folks, I just got weak in the knees and then it from dehydration. It is a little hot. Folks, I'm telling you the demons are real. And they always seem to hit me in the knees and the lower legs. Some righteous water, this water's so righteous. Oh, lady, you're such a nice lady. Listen, that lady even said she needs, we need more strong men. Listen, men, if you don't know how to change the tire on your car, go over to the website. We're going to have a class. We're going to do a class on how to properly go up and down a ladder, too. Yes, friends, I hate to tell you, there's a right and a wrong way to go up and down a ladder. you got to have three points of contact at all times. Don't test me, friends. I know these things. Hey. That's right. Talking to you, buddy. Yep. Right. Mm. Sir, get that thing in the shop. It sounds horrible. Listen, ladies, you, you got to get your men over to the website. They don't even know how to. When your cars make a funny noise, you got to get it checked out. Or if you're like Sergeant Grizzle Grits, you kind of already know what it is and you can fix it yourself. Folks, we live in an economy. We got to learn to fix things ourselves. We can't afford to. To call the repairman, we just can't afford it. We can't afford groceries. Listen, Miss Grizzle Grits, she ran off with all the bill money, so it's a good thing that God told Sergeant Grizzle Grits to, to do a little prepping. I'm gonna be eating some beans and rice here soon, but that's all right, folks. That's why we got it. Look. Go to the website, friend. Folks, you just gotta do a little here. I mean, if you just buy a bag of rice when you go get your groceries, it's like, I don't know, maybe. I don't remember, folks. It might be 10 bucks. It might be 20 bucks. But listen, that thing, will, that thing will give you food for a week. It'll feed your family for a week. Get the 20-pound bag. All you need is a little bit of water, a little bit of heat source. Go to the website, friends. We're going to be doing classes on this. Because this government ain't looking out for us. That's right, brother. You know, that just gave Sergeant Grizzle Grits a little flashback. You know, I miss the smell of diesel. Reminds me of when we were loading up on the going on those missions in Afghanistan. That's right, friends. We would be doing our PMCS. We'd have the vehicles getting all warmed up. Oh, I'll tell you, there's just something. Folks, this isn't a homosexual comment, but it's a, there's something about a bunch of men loading up on a vehicle with weapons and smell of seep, the oil, the weapon oil, the lubrication, the smell of diesel and the dust in your face, friends. I, I can't describe it. Friends, you got to, hey, you got to experience. Look at these women. All these women are out of control, folks. But friends, I, I just can't explain it. You gotta be there. That's why I can't tell you about the Cooney Thursday. You just you gotta have been there, folks. Look, friends, I've just seen and experienced too much. That's why we're gonna have to make a movie about this at some point. But we got a long ways to go, folks. Hey! That's right, friend, that's right.
our veterans. That's right. Y'all gotta stop the harm. We're not gonna put up with it anymore. The, the, the guy in the car in the back, he was videotaping himself, friends. We gotta stop it. Oh, here they come. Oh, good grief. Help me with the duckies, friends. I, I, I'm praying that it's something innocent. But I, I have a feeling it's not. I have a feeling it's something bad. God's just telling me it's something bad. Because little duckies are something that children play with in the bathtub. And oh, good Lord Jesus, I don't even want to think about that stuff. Folks, y'all got to see some of this. Telling you, God, God is not going to be kind on y'all. Oh, my goodness. You know, God does say all sins created equal. But listen. The Bible strictly says for that sin, you get a millstone and it goes around your neck and you go in the bottom of the ocean, folks. He don't say that about stealing to feed your family or telling a lie. But I could be wrong, folks. You know, this is a journey. We're, we're learning new things every day. But I just know you don't mess with the kids. And folks, don't come find Sergeant Grizzle Grizzle. Oh, it won't work out for you. Please don't, don't do it. I'm so highly trained. Folks, I'm, 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 I'm trained in gardening. That's right, friends. I know how to do a little gardening and love language. That's right. Folks, I'm a, I'm a master communicator. That's why I'm out here, friends. Some of y'all know I used to, Oh, here's another one. What's, what's up with this stuff? That lady is not a friendly. That lady is evil. Look at it. She's got the demonic stuff on the car. People are so sick. Stop harming our... Hey, stop harming our veterans. God, these people are so despicable. That's right, lady. Ah, she pointed at me, but I, I think that was an angry point, but it don't matter. Hunk your horn, lady. It's a free country. Well, not really, but we're trying to get back to it being a free country. All that leaving there is definitely rotten. Listen, I don't think everyone with blue hair is bad, but goodness gracious. It don't take a rocket scientist to understand these things. Listen, Sergeant Grizzlegrits had yellow hair in high school, but I was a surfer and it was the 90s, but nowadays it's perverted. What's up with the duckies? I don't understand it. What is it? Tell me. Folks, these, these people, it's like a secret cult. Oh, maybe they're gonna come. Look, come back here. Come on. I, I, folks, I might have a, I may have someone to explain to me the whole duck thing. Folks, I don't like not knowing stuff. That's how I was able to capture all the evidence and, and get these people we're resigning right now. Hey, you. Right. Folks, I, I'm about to lose my mind. Listen, I'm not really gonna lose my mind. Don't, don't have this. Oh, we're about to fly away here, friends. The devil wants to send me out to the Gulf of Mexico. Friends, all I know is that duckies only belong in the, look, there's more. The only duckies in the fire base is in the bathtub for the kitties at bath time. We don't, we don't do that kind of stuff. There's more duckies. What's up with the duckies? That's right, friend. Oh. Right, brother. That's right. That's right. We're going to do it. That's right, brother. That's right. Hey. Watch the sign. videotape me it's okay right here hmm. looking at all y'all folks over there you nice folks you nice perverted people leaving work for the day to go home for the weekend I know some of y'all are going back to your your liberal states but you come down here you do harm on us and then you go back up there for the weekend oh folks I just know too much these people aren't even from the area they hand pick them and send them down here but then when they get caught and they get sued, they just send them somewhere else. Folks, it's a it's a shuffleboard game. That's why they gotta resign. They, we gotta do it. We gotta do what they try to do to me, but we're gonna do it legally because they actually did break laws. Sir, the only thing Sergeant Grizzlegrits was was guilty of is being a white man and, and doing the right thing. Folks, if I had done something wrong, they would I wouldn't be an employee right now, folks. They would have sent me the letter of termination for whatever they found, but they didn't because they're a bunch of cheats and scoundrels in this place. 
And all these people know it. That's right, sir, you know it. Maybe your horn don't work. Great, buddy. Helps on the way, sir. Helps on the way. Oh, friends. People, people flicking me off. I can't believe it. These people are just flicking me. That's right. Stop harming our veterans, ladies. Stop harming our veterans. Good grief. Folks, I wish we could just terminate everybody in there. We'd, we'd get more work done if, if nobody showed up to work on Monday. There, there would be veterans getting well. Because they wouldn't go in there and they wouldn't be pumped with all the drugs they're trying to pump us through. Folks, they're turning all the veterans into the T's, folks. It's, it's true. That's why they had to get rid of Sergeant Grizzle Grits. They, did, they, they couldn't have these homeless veterans coming into voluntary service. Because, folks, I used to give these people motivational speeches. Friends, I was a peer support specialist for like six years. These people didn't know who they were messing around with. Peacefully, peacefully, folks. We're, we're all peaceful. Bus driver, that's right, that's right, friend. That's a good bus driver. Talking to you, sir. Talking to you. Right. Hey! Folks, you gotta stop messing with the veterans. Look, we don't ask for a lot, but you just gotta cease and desist. Cease the harm you're causing us. Oh, goodness gracious, I should be at home playing Call of Duty right now. But this is way much more righteous. Folks, if you, look, here's another one. What's going on with these things? Look at these perverted people. Oh, God, that person was so gluttonous. Look how, Jesus, we don't want to pass judgment, but... Folks, you're not supposed to be 400 pounds. It's it's unhealthy, and, you know, God didn't design... God ain't 400 pounds, folks. Listen, in the Garden of Eden, Adam didn't have fast food and all this GMOs. He had some righteous fruit. But it was the woman who tricked us, folks. We gotta stop listening to the women. That's right. I hate to say it. Just go read the Bible. It's in the it's in the beginning. That's right, lady. Oh, there's so much. There's so many despicable people in this area. But there's so much righteous people down here too. And it's a shame that they gotta they gotta count on this demonic place for healthcare. It ain't healthcare, folks. It's perverted care. Don't get your care here if you can. Go to the community. We got we got VA choice. Demand it. When these people come to work, shouldn't be one veteran in here. Not until we clean and get these folks out of here peacefully. Look, more jeeps with these weirded stuff in it. Folks, I don't understand these things. I, oh, I hope someone I hope someone explained it in the chat. I can't read the chats right now, folks. I'm, I'm doing God's work. God's got me cast out. God, you know, if God's speaking, listen, folks, if you're tuned in, if, if you're tuned in and God's compelling you to go do something like this, just go do it. Listen, every day you procrastinate, more veterans getting harmed. More of us to get out here, the quicker this nightmare is going to end. And it's a nightmare, folks. Those of y'all that know my family, just go ask my family. This doesn't just affect me, it affects my children. Gosh, these people are so horrible. I hadn't seen my kids in like a week. That's right, brother. That's right. Hey. Folks, this is the time my children need me, for goodness sakes. We're not going to let, we're not going to let a bunch of perverts get in the way of me and my children. That's right. Folks, don't come find me. Don't you dare, I know y'all know where I live, don't you better just stay off that street. I got so many eyes and ears on that street, friends, and there's a lot of good, there's a lot of good veterans that live there, too. You don't want to mess with us. Folks, we came together during the hurricane. That's right, we didn't have power. The whole neighborhood came together. And Sergeant Grizzlegrits was, oh, hold on. Stop it. Sergeant Grizzlegrits was the one that, that, that led the effort on the street. I made sure my neighbors had food, and I, I helped them with extra generators, folks. It's true. I'm a righteous man. Y'all gotta stop messing with me. It ain't about me, folks. You gotta stop messing with the with the with the veterans. I'm praying that y'all leave the children alone. Y'all gotta stop it right now. Cause listen, friends. Once I'm done with this, we're going we're going to. Oh, good grief, folks. We just gotta stop the madness. This is this is insanity. What's going on? You all know it. You're just waiting for someone to step up and, and tell you. And here I am, folks. This is the end times. Whether you want to admit, admit it or not. Christ, the white Christian men are being persecuted. <laughs> Folks, I should be in there in my, my office doing my job, but they got a lady of color in there because they got rid of me to put her in there. It ain't about you, ma'am. We're not going to make it about you, but you're not qualified. You had two, you had two qualified candidates that they, they didn't select. 
because they they, were, they had orders to install a lady of color. Folks, it's all on the website. These are public officials. It ain't harassment. If I was involved in this, my name would be on there too, and you know all about me. Folks, we got to do this so this nightmare stops as people cease and desist. Trust me, we don't like the harassments, but we don't have a choice. I mean the harassment towards us. We're not doing no harassments. We're leaving the folk leaving people alone. We're all victims here, except the monsters that we're demanding resignations because they're the ones that follow the illegal orders. Friends, go ahead and call your congressman right now. Just go ahead and call him. Call him and call him back in 10 minutes. But, but listen, folks, they're just they're making a tally of how many phone phone calls they're getting on the topic. If they get like more than 30 calls and they let the district director know. And then when the when they get too many calls, they'll let the chief of staff know and then they'll let the congressperson know. Folks, we demand action. <laughs> Listen, friends, I want I want fish oil for everybody. I want them for Sergeant Grizzle Grits. I want them for the G's, the B's, and I want them for the Tangos. I, look, everybody needs fish oil. They gotta stop messing with us. This is outrageous. Folks, you can't show fear. Listen, that horrible lady, Miss Brown, the only nice thing you ever told me, the only piece of advice was, you told me not to show fear in these folks, and I didn't. I didn't I didn't have fear in you. Ma'am, I saw fear in you. That's why I, I felt sorry for you. And ma'am, listen, I, I just gotta explain this. I don't take any pleasure in any of this stuff. Just go ask anyone that knows me. Go ask my family. I have to pray. Hold on. Oh, that's the best part, friends. That's the best part. Stop harming our veterans right now, sir. I know you're doing it. Stop it. Stop harming our veterans. Stop following illegal orders, lady. I know you are. Good grief. Right. Help's on the way. Stop. Uh, she looks like a wife. There you go. Yeah, you better wave, lady. You know, you know, you know. That's right. You know I'm working. Oh, that's a, uh, I don't know, man. That look. Friends. Friends, that was a perverted man with a perverted mustache. Oh, God. You know, they talk about taking the mustache ride. Oh, good Lord. Folks, stop testing me. I know these things. Listen, Miss Chris Brown, I, I feel horrible because I, I know you're, I know you got a family, ma'am, and that's as far as we're gonna go. We just ain't about harming no one, ma'am. I prayed hard about, because I know this is gonna cause you a little pain and suffering, but maybe not. Maybe you're just so far gone that you don't even care about any of this because they already got you. You're going parachuting. You, you, you know, they're just gonna send an email out on Monday and let everybody know that they got a new new leadership coming in the week. That's right. Listen, ma'am, I don't take any pleasure in any of this stuff. You caused this, I'm just here to clean it up. I didn't let you get away with it. I'm holding your feet to the fire. Because you held my supervisor's feet to the fire. That's right, friends. I gave him two days to spend a pay for vaping on campus. We got police reports of this demonic lady in the voluntary service, Miss Perfect. Folks, this lady was going after veterans and volunteers. These ladies, these, these people are in their 60s and 70s. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Folks, these people know. People know we mean business. Listen, friends. Talking to you. you. Gotta go to the website. All the evidence is there. Pope Sergeant Grizzlegrits has a strict policy on telling the truth. Just go ask my family. I don't like anybody lying to me. Because I told some lies in my past and I felt horrible about it. And God. Hey! God squared me away. <laughs> Go to the website, all the evidence is there. Folks, there goes the perverts in the police vehicles. I bet you he just got done with a second, second act of debauchery over there in the cemetery, friends. These people are so bad, they're so bad. But folks, there's some more of the weird stuff. I think they're all beaten over here. Maybe they may come talk to me. I hope they do, folks. I'm not afraid of these people. That's right. We're doing it for you. We're going to keep the perverts away from your children. Folks, that's a child. Stay away from our children, for goodness sakes. Listen, folks, this crusade ain't gonna just end with the VA. We're gonna make sure all the perverts... Well, we're gonna put you back on the list, and you're not gonna be allowed to go near the schools. It's not gonna be a thousand feet. It's gonna be a mile. We're gonna make sure you're not nowhere near a school. 
We're gonna put a, we're gonna put a tracking device on you. Folks, we gotta get back to the way, we gotta get back to common sense. We don't have anything that's common sense anymore, folks. It's uncommon sense, because y'all don't got it. Y'all got to smarten up. I shouldn't be the only patriot out here doing this garbage. I, gotta, I, should, be, I should be working right now. But they took that, folks, they took it from me. They denied my, my legal request for family medical, and they lied and said I went AWOL. Folks, these people are so despicable. Look at these people. Look at these people. So let's go these people scurry away. Look at these people. I'm talking to you. Stop harming our veterans, lady. I know you're doing it. Stop harming our veterans. Stop it. See, that lady's scared because she knows I mean business. I'm, I'm not violent, folks. Look, we got more duckies. Let's go. You know, maybe it's like rank. Folks, is, it, is that right? Is it rank in the perverted club? If you got all the duckies, that means you've done all the perverted acts. See, I'm telling you, God gave me a gift, folks. Don't test me. I know it means something. And I know the more you got, the deeper the deeper in you are. That's right, friends. Folks, stop testing me, for goodness sakes. I'm telling you all this stuff. And I'm not crazy, folks. It's an act. It's an act. I just got to get people's attention. If I didn't have all the gear, I'd be out here in a clown outfit. That's right, buddy. We're taking back our VA. Go to the, go to the website. Go to the web. I'm a whistleblower. Right, that's right, friend. Hey, we're doing it for you. We're doing it for our veterans. Call, hey, call your congressman right now. Hey, I'm talking to you, sir. Oh. Hey. Oh, these people make me sick. Look at you. Hey. Folks, look at that. Look at that. It's a Tesla. That, that, that's a righteous vehicle there. Folks, that thing's cameled up. You know that thing's bulletproof? You know when I get my settlement, you know. Sergeant, look at more duckies. Oh my gosh, that person is really deep in whatever that is. Look, folks. We're going to buy us one of those Tesla vehicles because they're bulletproof. And we, we think we think Mr. Elon Musk is a righteous guy. I mean, we're, <laughs> I don't like the I don't like the, the chips in the brain. That, that ain't godly, folks. But again, I don't have to understand all these things. He's... He's doing so. Hey, all right, lady. See, that's listen, folks. That was a that's a social worker in a government GSA car. That lady was an older lady because she remembers a time that this place wasn't perverted with all the perverted social workers. Folks, a lot of these social workers are demonic women. I hate to tell you, I used to work with them. Folks, I had a lady tell me I had to take down all the perverted all the perverted books in my office because I had them there to warn the volunteers that they got to get the crap out of their kid their grandkids' homes. Friends, this lady, you're a nice lady, but you got a lot of problems at home. You, you need to stop flirting with all the men around here and get them to do your work. You know, this lady like to flirt with all the men. And then the men, they're weak. I hate to say it, friend. You're, you're, I don't, you're a good friend. I'm not going to say it. But I would never do this lady's work. She'd come around voluntary service and, and demand the other gentleman there do all her work. And he did. He liked doing it. But I never gave this lady an ounce of slack because she's a GS-11 or a 10, probably an 11. She's got to earn her keep like everybody else. Listen, you demonic social work ladies. There ain't no free lunches around Sergeant Grizzle Grits, and y'all know that. Listen, that. Listen, folks. Last year, I had I had the social workers abusing the voluntary service. They were sending their veterans multiple times for us to pay the electric bills. That's right, friends. Hold on, friends. This is the, this is the best part. Right, friends. I'm, I'm looking at you. All right, you look good. Oh, Lord, have mercy. That lady needs to put some clothes on in that car. That's too much for me to look at. That's right, lady. Stop it. I know you're doing it. Folks, are, are these people taking their GSA heart call, cars home for the night? Folks, I think these people are driving their cars home for the night. That's illegal. Holy crap, folks, you just got to stand out here. I just saw two GSA cars head this way. What time is it, friends? They may be working late, but I don't know. Oh, my gosh. Friend, is that a middle finger, or is that just you resting your finger? There you go. I like it, friend. Thank you. See, folks, I'm, 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 I'm skilled in communications. The man just corrected himself because he don't want to get off the wrong signal. Because you don't want to mess with a righteous guy like Sergeant Grizzlewitz. Grief, folks. It's madness. Listen, if you're taking the GSA cars home and you're parking it in front of your house, that's illegal. We're going to find out. Trust me. 
Listen, friends, those cars got tracking devices on them. Don't ask me how I know these things, but I just know. I'm sure they're all turned off. Folks, I'm gonna have a little bit of pleasure when I go before the oversight committee and, and I testify before the Congress. Listen, just please. Friends, I, I, I can't go in that Senate hall room where those two men were doing disgusting foul things. I just can't. In fact, I think we just need to burn that whole building down. You. Folks, is it 3.30 yet? Maybe 4 o'clock. That's more of the demons leave for the day. Hey! Still be open when you get there. You need to slow down. Y'all people got to get a check. Listen, folks, heaven, heaven has a weight capacity, kind of like these airlines now. You got you to gotta slim it down, folks. You got to get righteous. God don't want a bunch of big old gluttonous folks that weigh 400 pounds. That, that shows you're not righteous and you're not disciplined. I, I, listen, folks, I understand if you got a health condition, but, but some of y'all are just sloppy. Hey, lady, how you doing there? Lady's got a shirt that said hope. Ma'am, we're done with hope. You gotta get out here and get some action. Hope didn't work out for us last time. The hope and change we got wasn't with the change and hope we were looking for. Because it was demonic. Oh, these people are so rotten. Not you, you look like a good person over there. I'm just pointing at people to get y'all's attention. Look at this man. Sir, the pandemic's over. Take that silly mask off. Folks, these people are under a spell. That man's out here on a bicycle with a mask on. Folks. Did you hear what I said? The man's got a mask on. He's out here on a bicycle, for God's sake. These people. I gotta help these people. Hey, stop harming our veterans. I know you are. Look at that demon right there. Oh, God. You can just tell. These demons got the dark tent on the windows because they don't want no one to see who they are. Folks, it's despicable. These people are so despicable. They drive around in these fancy cars. We got homeless veterans out here, folks. Again, I don't, I don't, I don't hate on anyone that I don't hate on anyone that worked for it, fair and square. But if you got your job because of the color of your skin or the way you look, we're gonna do an audit, and you're gonna have to, well, you're gonna have to turn in that Cadillac, sir. I'm sorry, you're not gonna be able to afford it on your unemployment. Right, lady. Good Lord have mercy. Hey, listen, you ladies gotta gotta put a little more clothes on. I'm sorry, it's just. We gotta get back to being modest. We don't need to see all that stuff in public. Listen, Sergeant Grizzlegrits used to really like looking at that type of stuff, but I don't know more because, folks, we gotta get righteous, okay? We gotta get right with God. We gotta get on our hands and knees and pray. And listen, if you're doing sinful, lustful stuff, you gotta cease and desist. If you're married and you're having a little bit of problems and you can work it out, you gotta go find someone you trust, a good counselor or something. Good Lord, that lady was, oh, I don't wanna say it. See, that's a good nurse there. That lady's, I, I know that lady. That lady's a good nurse. Hey! Man, you gotta start driving again. Listen, friends, the only time you should let your wife drive the car is if you're coming home from an appointment and you're under anesthesia. Friends, I know that sounds sexist, but we gotta get back to being men again. Driving around without a shirt on. That's what I'm talking about. It ain't gay. It ain't it's about being manly again. These people want us to be ashamed of ourselves. They want us to. That's why they're removing us from the jobs, folks. That's why they got your honorable guys walking around in red high heels. You just got. You can't do it, Mr. Trumpster. I don't think you've ever been caught in high heels, and I, I don't ever expect to see a photo of that, old friend. Folks, you know, when the lawsuit's done and the money's paid out, we may go buy us a new fishing boat. You know, a dream of Sergeant Grizzlegrits was to buy a nice fishing boat. But it ain't gonna be for me, folks. It's gonna be 
the Sergeant Grizzle Grits fishing experience. We're gonna take veterans out and do some charters. Folks, I'm telling you, it's each charge is three hundred thousand dollars. Folks, just do the math. I got them on eight. I got them on eight charges, and they can't scurry away. They got I got evidence on all eight of them. So just do the math, friends. What's eight times? What's eight times three hundred thousand dollars? Oh, good lord, they're gonna kill me. Folks, I don't want our taxpayer money. I just want this problem fixed. But folks, they're gonna give me some. some they're gonna give me a little bit of back pay. Oh yeah, from July of last year, when they should have picked me, the most right, most righteous qualified guy for the job. Folks, that right there is like eighty thousand dollars that they're gonna have to pay back. That's why you gotta report this stuff. You gotta go to a whistleblower website. Folks, go to sergeantgrizzlegrits.com. We'll tell you how to do it. It's so easy. You can do it anonymously. But y'all gotta start coming forward. You better stop harming our veterans, lady. Stop harming our veterans, lady. We're looking right at you. Stop it. Stop harming our veterans. You look like a good veteran, sir. Ah, well, you're definitely not. That's right, friend. You gotta go look at the sign. That's right. Let's go to the website. Go to the website. Look, buddy. That's me. Ugh. They're, hey, buddy, they're, they're pushing anti-white DEI policies in there. I was the assistant chief. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm friendly. I was the assistant chief of voluntary service. They removed me and put a black lady in there. I'm not taking it up. We're suing them on eight charges. Call your congressman, uh, Anna Paulina Luna. Call her up. Call. She, you're right. Go to the website, sir. I got all the evidence. SergeantGrizzleGrits.com. Hey, I'm on YouTube. I'm on X. Okay. Support us. We got to get these demons out of there. Hey, y'all continue to be righteous. Hey! Uh, folks, y'all gotta get helmets, look. You gotta make sure your passenger's wearing a helmet. You know how horrible you'd feel if your passenger or something happened to them and, and you lived? Good grief. Hey! Oh, yeah. Folks. Folks, when you see the demons, they got the tattoos on their arms, folks. Stay righteous. I'm telling you, folks, when you got the gift, you got the gift. Uh -oh, yeah, what time's it getting to be, folks? Out here a little longer, friends. Look, there ain't, there ain't a. Listen, friends, out here we, we train the standard. We don't train the time, so it don't matter how long we're out here. And we're righteous, and we got excellence. And we, you know, we know what leadership looks like. Folks, for goodness' sake, I was in E7 for when I retired. Look at these demonic people. It was a undercover, uh, maybe sheriff. I don't know. Good luck to you, sir. We're going to say a prayer for you when you go to that demonic Bay Pines. Look, these people don't got a choice. They, they live in the Dom here, friends, and they're not doing them well. They're doing them harm. These people are horrible. How's that Dom treating you, brother? They tell you not to talk to me, did they? I'm a whistleblower. I used to work here. I was in voluntary service. I was your assistant chief. So when you go over to voluntary service, I got nothing against that black lady. That, shit, that was my job. They, they got rid of me and put her in there. You know when you go over there and get your laundry soap and your food? They're telling me. Get under the mind manipulation, buddy. Hey, buddy, go to the website. Whoa, friends, we're about to fly away. Look, friends, right there. Friends, they're telling all the veterans in there to stay away from me. They're telling them I hate the gays. Listen, friends, these people are demonic. I told you I can't make this stuff up. Listen, when, when you're when you're at one of these facilities, the, the Dom, when you're out here talking to Sergeant Grizzle Grits, they may just kick you out of it for a violation. Folks, these people are so rotten. Here we go. Stop harming our veterans. Stop it, sir. Oh, these people are so rotten. Stop harming. Hey, I know you, brother. I know you. 
I know you. You're a good man. You're a good man, brother. Oh, man. And that, that guy, listen, folks, that guy, I think his name's Willie. I don't want to say people's names. Listen, friends, that guy's the guy out there doing all the, all the, all the, all the, the work in the, on the... Folks, it's been a long... He's been out there doing all the yard work. Friend, you know I don't, I don't, I don't have nothing against color. Because I came out there and talked to you all the time. I'm the, yeah, the guy that was all dressed up, his beard wasn't as matted. Friends that know me out there, you know I was a righteous guy. I, I look past all those things. Those things don't matter to me. Good grief. Folks, there's so many good people in here, they're held hostage because they don't got a choice. Because if they come out here and do what I'm doing, then they'll, they'll try to fire you like they did me. And they may not have all the evidence like Sergeant Grizzle Gritz does. Talking to you, lady. Right? Right. Right. Oh, good Lord Jesus, we don't want to sell away. Look, friends, we're not like that cruise commercial back in the day. We're not going to sell away, sell away. Oh, Lord Jesus. Look, they scurry out the other gate. Folks, they scurry out the other gate because they don't want to get a good public dressing down. But it don't matter. It's going to catch up to them eventually. Friends, we got another ambulance. We're just going to go ahead and get ahead of this one. Good Lord Jesus. We pray for the first responders. Oh, Lord, we're about to blow away. You know, friends, uh, we forgot to cut a little wind cells in our little van. But we'll get that squared away tonight at the FOB. You lady right there. That's right. You. You, man. you got the love sticker on your car. Do you love everyone? Do you hate the white men like these people in here? That's right, that's right, brother. Look, friends, there's more there's more friendlies out here. You gotta get out here. These people are weak and they're scared. They've never seen nothing like this, friends, and that's why we got them on their heels. They're scurrying up in DC to figure out what to do down here. We're not going to let them get away with the retirement. They got to go. They, they, they better not come to work on Monday. That gives them all weekend to figure out what to do with these folks. But they better not come to work. They better not get retirement. You better not get transferred. Listen, friends, we're working with the oversight committee. Stop testing with us, please. You're going to go before Congress. You're going you're gonna to have to explain this. Because what y'all have done is so horrible. Listen, friends, it makes the Phoenix thing. Friends, y'all remember the Phoenix where they had the veterans on the one wait list. And they lied to Congress, folks. This is more of the diversity hires. They lied because they're incompetent. Folks, there was veterans dying because they weren't getting the care they needed. Hey, stop harming our veterans. Stop harming our veterans, lady. These people got to stop harming us. What do we got here? Stop harming our veterans. Okay, you look like a righteous. You know, you give me a wave. I know you're friendly. Folks, the employees that are giving me the wave, they're the ones that are held hostage. We got a hostage situation here. At least they get a break for two days and they can go to church and get righteous so they can deal with this stuff for another week. That's right, that's right. These folks love it. Folks, their air is done. It's our time to get out here. We've, we've let these folks down. We gotta get out here. Folks, we're, we're so far behind the curve. We have, we've allowed this to happen. Again, because we were in the motorcycle clubs and we were in the bars and raising families and friends we should have we should have been joining the legions and the vfws and guess what as soon as i get a break i'm gonna go join one i'm not gonna go have a beer i'm gonna have a nice big old unsweet iced tea at one of these places sergeant grizzle grits we don't drink alcohol no more god delivered us from that that's right that's right that's right friend. we're not afraid no more we're gonna run these demons out of here they're gonna go back to the liberal hills where they came from poor ducks friends i don't understand Listen, friends, the, the pervert in that Jeep has driven by here like five times. Friends, stop wasting your gas. Just, I'll give you an interview. Don't these people believe in global warming? Why are they wasting fuel? Good grief. Folks, it's all hypocrite. These people are all hypocrites. No, they'll drive the fancy cars. They just want you taking the bus. Folks, why do you think they're trying to do 15-minute cities? Just go look it up. Don't take my word for it.
but man, you uh, That was a lot of men in that truck. That's what I'm talking about, folks. You, get, you gotta get, go back in the gym. You gotta, you gotta lose the weight. How you gonna, folks? How you gonna run from the zombies? Let's go watch that movie. It's like rule number two. You gotta have cardio. If you weigh 400 pounds, you ain't gonna get far. Folks, I'm so sorry. Oh, folks, like Jesus, forgive me. This is my favorite part, folks. I'm so sorry. I don't want to take any pleasure in doing this, but we have to. Oh, here we go. Look, they line, they line all, well, not all of them, but there's some honorable employees. There may be some, some veterans that are held hostage in there, folks, but we're going to have some perverts in this group, I can already tell. Look at the cars. Oh, let's see how many, let's see how many demons flip us off. Look at this, is definitely one right here. Look at this demon. Right here. This is the, oh, you're a good man, you're a good man, you're a good man. I'm so sorry for him. Stop harming our veterans! right folks I used to work with these people I know I know almost all of them they hadn't seen me in six months because I got run out of here for being a white guy that's why we're gonna sue y'all we're gonna sue y'all right. look at that it's a World War II veteran friends we gotta stop the madness we can't let her hey stop it sir these people make me so sick so, so, friends I'm sorry I, I just we, we don't get a lot of pleasure out here we get so much hate well, there's a lot of love but when you get to publicly dress, folks, again, if it was legal to tar and feather these folks, we'd have already done it. But we're peaceful. What's up with the ducks? It's, it's a perverted thing, friends. I know it's perverted. Because, listen, friends, you can't put a car. It's hard to put a baby seat in a, in a Jeep. Stop testing me. These people aren't family people. And if they are, they, they got transgender kids. And it's perverted, and they got to cease and desist, friends. Friends, if a, if a child believes in Santa Claus, a child don't know what sexuality is. Go look up the video of the of the psychologist. He asked the five-year-old, would you rather have $10,000 or a, a chocolate cookie? Folks, the kid took the cookie like every kid would. You can't eat money. You gotta stop the madness. Children don't know. That's why they need strong men. They need good, strong women. <coughs> oh. Folks, that may be a surf pro van. I don't know. Maybe they're doing a follow-up. Or maybe they got some more mold in the kitchen, folks. I don't know. Because when you got a little mold up in your kitchen, you got a little mold up in your kitchen. Get some eggs and bacon. Hold my mold on my bacon. Folks, you can't eat there. You just can't. We can't trust these people. They're giving us mold. Sean Turner, you must resign, Sean Turner. Sean Turner's the associate director or one of these silly names they gave him. Sir, you had mold in the kitchen. You lied about it. You said it was maintenance. And not only that, sir, you're so damn incompetent. You're in charge of the VA police, and you have your police officers doing doing sex on the body cam. Listen, friends. Trust me. Trust me, friends. A absence makes the heart grow fonder. Friend, you should have just waited till you got all, you got home. If, you, if you're so perverted, you got to do that stuff while you're at work. Friend, we don't need you here. You got to go with the rest of the perverts. And listen, we're going to demand an audit. We're going to get a FOIA request of all that stuff. Actually, we're already working on it. Right, friend. Right. You gotta go. Y'all are so rotten. Friends, I take no pleasure in this stuff. But I'm... You gotta get out of here, friends. I, I don't have to pray with you anymore. That's right, lady. That's right. That's right. That's right, my brother. That's right. Go to the website, ma'am. You won't be disappointed, trust me. Unless you're a pervert, then you'll get angry. But we want y'all to get angry. Because when y'all get angry, y'all get sloppy because you're not disciplined. And then you get exposed, then you get you get fired. Folks, we're gonna have so many we're, oh, this, this other trick is they're gonna have so many so many resignations, folks. They're gonna run out of the paper. Listen, you demonic pentad, just go to voluntary. I don't know if that lady we we, still, we had a lot of paper. Ask the gentleman there, he's a good man, he'll know you how to get paper. Stop arming our veterans! Well, uh, that, that may not have been served pro, but listen, folks, they were there. Trust me. Just go get that FOIA request. Look at these. Stop harming our veterans. Stop harming our veterans. Stop harming our veterans. Stop it, lady. Righteous, that's right. You look like a good, righteous person. That's right, friend, go to the website. Oh, God, you, that, oh, Jesus.
Oh, good Lord Jesus. That man had a man bun. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Lord Jesus, help these men. They don't know what they're doing. Stop listening to women. Jesus, I, I don't think you had a man bun, but if you did, sir, it don't matter. You're Jesus. You can do whatever the heck you want. Folks, you got to stop testing Jesus. I'm telling you, he's a nice guy. He's the nice. He's so nice. Friends, there's, there's a side of Jesus you don't want to mess with. Folks, trust me. I, I saw a little bit of it. He put me through a little hell, folks. I had to. Hell, I'm still going through hell right now, but it's all... I got to pay back my pittance. You know, he took the alcohol from Sergeant Grizzle Grits. And the VA couldn't help me with that. They tried. They just, they, they're demonic. They want to put you on drugs and keep you at home playing Call of Duty. That way you get the laundry done for Mrs. Grizzle Grits. Great friends. Oh, good Lord. Oh. More. More of the stuff. What is that? I'm losing my mind out here trying to figure out what's up with these damn duckies. Lord Jesus, I pray it ain't nothing perverted. Folks, we're gonna we're gonna wrap it up here soon, you know. <laughs> Folks, we don't we don't live in this area. We we live in another part of the area, and they, they want to come harass me. Folks, just cease and desist. It ain't gonna work out for you. I'm telling you. We got Congress looking in the uh, and listen, folks. I hate to tell you, you ain't gonna win the election. Your your guy hadn't done a good job, and all the demons that are propping him up and doing all the stuff behind the scenes, they're, they're all gonna go too. Listen, folks, we, we just, we're sick and tired of it. You're dragging us to World War III, and we don't, we want nothing, we want nothing to do with it. We just want peace. I don't got nothing against Russia. Why are y'all trying to start a war over there? Well, you've already started one. Why are you dragging our soldiers over there? Folks, listen, we don't stop this. We're going to have a whole generation of new veterans going here getting perverted. And, and they're not, they're going to, they're going to they're be missing legs and arms because they're using, folks, they're using the drone bombs on these people. But look it up. Don't take my word for it. Ukraine, there's about 200,000 or 300,000 wounded soldiers, amputees. Folks, they don't got no legs and arms because the Russians are dropping the drone bombs on them. Folks, I've seen it. It's so despicable. It's against every Geneva Convention thing you can think of. You don't, you don't, you're not supposed to wound and kill people that are giving up. Folks, I don't want to see my children or your children with missing arms and legs because these demons got us in the world with you. Folks, I don't want our cities to burn in a nuclear fire because these demons want it. And if they make it back, I don't want them to get care here because they ain't giving any care. They're harming us. Stop it, lady. It's a good gracious, I don't know. You're from California, sir. I don't know. I just don't. Don't come down here and pervert our state. Stop the madness. Stop harming our veterans. Stop harming our veterans. Stop harming our veterans. Oh, you people are so sick. Stop harming our veterans. More ducks, friends. I have to touch you Stop harming. Stop harming our veterans, you perverted people. Oh, you are. Uh, you make me sick. You make me sick. All right, folks. We're gonna we're gonna call it a day. You know, we got a lot of good work in here, and we met a lot of good people, and. We gave out some of these righteous business cards. All oh, the friends, just wait till you get one. They're so awesome. Friends, these people are demonic. I can't, I can't tell you how demonic these people are. You just gotta trust me. But help, help's on the way, folks. We got help on the way. Oh, good Lord Jesus. Friends, I appreciate you joining me. Look, we, we gotta get y'all out here. You know, we need to get a little sunlight. Oh wow, look at all these awesome people on here. Folks, listen. I didn't have a choice in the matter. God told me to do this. The VA is so broken. The VA fired me. Well, and then they had a they had to resend that. Folks, I'm still an employee here. <sighs> folks, we're suing them for eight charges. I'm, I'm gonna be a millionaire when this is done, and I, I don't like that, folks. It's horrible. I didn't want the money. Folks, I already know they're gonna be paying me a lot of money, but I'm still out here because it's wrong. If I just wanted, listen, folks. If I only cared about the money, I'd be at home playing Call of Duty. And getting the laundry squared away from Mrs. Grizzle Grits. But that ain't what God told me to do. And I, I knew God's talking to y'all. You gotta stop playing these games. You gotta tune in. 
All right, look, friends, we're going we're to be on later tonight, maybe. So come check us out there. I appreciate y'all. Y'all are righteous. Later.